What's up, everybody? Welcome to Table Story Sector 49. How's it going? Welcome to the show. How's everybody doing today? Everybody ready to, ready to judge <laughs> Dread it up? And I was supposed to drink some wine and I forgot. Wins. There's still time, Tash. We got we got a million wins in April. Funny. That's a million. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that's that's solid. And especially with Peachy on your team, I feel like that's. Peachy was the MVP at the end. Extra bonus yeah, wins. Yeah, Harry and us, we probably wouldn't have got yeah. all of those wins. Yeah, he had the the Mozambique kill. That Mozambique kill every game, Huge. every kill. Huge. <laughs> Is that like just the worst gun or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a pistol shotgun. Gotcha. Pistol shotgun. That's always what you want to go with. It's terrible. Feels like every BR game is always like medium range, medium range, and yeah, yeah. occasionally you get lucky with a long range shot. How's it going, everybody? How's everybody's weeks been? Great. Oh, oh just four games for right. five hours yesterday, man. I don't really How? know what I've done, but it's been nice. How's your day been, Brad? Oh, that, that's all it. I do is win, win, win. <laughs> I, uh, that's all I do. It's win, win, win. I absolutely decimated just these random people that I was playing a board game with last night. I don't know who they were. They're so irrelevant that and so bad at the game that I forgot them. But I know that I won the game. Uh, then I only got five hours sleep. And here I am. Luckily, I've got my fresh drink to drink. <laughs> what um? <laughs> what about you, Wank? How's your day been? It's been pretty great. Uh, I didn't, I didn't like do too well in a game that I played yesterday, but I had the consolation prize of of making the person that won uh, only get a very small amount of sleep. So that made me feel really <laughs> happy inside. It was good. That was good. That was nice. <laughs> uh, <laughs> knowing, yeah. knowing that they are in absolute pain today. Um, yeah. And they have a super long day today as well. Just, yeah. I don't know. I feel fantastic about it. It really, it's really enlivened me. It's 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 really good, Brad. I feel great. Thank you for letting us know about that. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. Really. It seems like everybody's in the right set of mind, state of mind for. Uh, I don't know. As soon as this goes, though, we know. It. Like the thing is, we always. Why do we do this every week? It's always like, "Hi, yeah, how are you?" And then it's zero to one hundred the moment we actually <laughs> yeah. start yeah. playing. Yeah, it's always the way. We always have this like real slow fucking uh, acceleration for the you fastest car on the channel. Lemmings this off of the cliff, fastest man. car on the channel right here. <laughs> yeah, the worst acceleration. That's what this is. I know how to talk about cars, guys. Okay, I know a lot about cars. I saw one once. I I just know that sometimes they're blue, and sometimes they're. I have so a blue car. That's all I need to know. <laughs> well, like, what car is that? It's a silver one. It's definitely possible. We just don't know. What color is our car? That we. Do uh, think? I think it's gonna be like neon, orange. Ash. Yeah, oh, it would probably orange. be like. It'd probably be like, yeah, it'd be like one of those cars that has like, like it's neon orange, but then one of the doors is like a rusty brown. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it just meant like half of it got blown up, didn't it? Like we were in a yeah, moving no, truck, and I think it, I heard the sides got blown off at some point. Uh, so thought, yeah. But you were just a frame rolling. Yeah. <laughs> it was basically just like a box the, frame. I'm surprised that the uh, the tables to bus bus wasn't in this show. <laughs> you know? How did that not come from this show? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Replaced it with a van, quick. It was, yeah. I, you know, I want to credit it to Goobers pretty much. He just started screaming bus, like when he rolled the chat. Yeah. Everybody's like, what the fuck is he talking about? Was, I don't know, insane. let's get on. What was it? It was like Dan jumped on a bus or something. Yeah. He rolled yeah. insanely high, right? Yeah, but Goobers just started like, screaming it that we had like, to get, get on, on the bus. bus. Get on the bus. bus! <laughs> and it was like, okay. And it became Final our thing. Final urge took over. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dan crit jumped on a bus. Yeah. We have to fucking believe in a higher power to get past Wax campaign, guys. Yeah. <laughs> we had to invent a higher power, a bus. Uh, Jay, don't want to fucking have to spoil anything for you, but everyone invented a higher power. Sorry. Yeah. I, I, sorry, I didn't mean to tread on anybody else's higher power with our. What bus. Uh, what color Check. die do you guys Play want me to roll to see uh, how well you're gonna do today? Oh, no. I have a green one. Pink. I have a black one. 
Jeff an mm. orange one. I do have an orange one. I have a purple one. I have a blue Don't one. Trust that orange and one. I have a pink one. You have a yellow one? No. Don't trust orange and pink. The blue one I, I got a yellow one. Yeah. How about I roll a yellow dice? No. Your your die roll means nothing to me. <laughs> I'm rolling a yellow D twelve. I have and it means nothing. A metal I have a metal D twelve. I don't know I'm where mine gonna, is. I rolled it too. Abstain from from telling you the number I rolled and <laughs> just, uh, just hide that behind my. Uh, All right, my I guess I'll choose. We'll go with the orange blue. one. Blue. No, I said blue though. Okay. 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 It was still okay. Yeah. yeah Jay, okay. how much of that banana can you get in your mouth at once? Whack! Roll a d20. <laughs> I will roll my metal d20. We're gonna roll the metal one. Okay. Where's my metal one? Oh, that fell off the table. Hold on. If he rolls a 20, Jay has to. 19. It was a 19. All right, guys. Okay. All right. Tier three subs, get ready for the tier three sub camera. Uh, <laughs> all right, guys. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Imagine if he had come back <laughs> with it. Just, <laughs> that done it. On my face. The whole thing. <laughs> the peel is just it's splayed just like, across. Like it a looks face like hugger. A, yeah, it looks he went like and got another banana hugger. and didn't peel it. Just put the fucking thing in. <laughs> <laughs> we all know Jay, Jay can deep throat that banana. Come on, let's be honest here. Let's. I've be... never seen him put it in that hole before. Is it? <laughs> I'm... What's up, guys? Hello, it's me, the <laughs> sexual icon of table. All right, story. everybody, why don't we go around the room? Hi. Let's do some introductions. Brad, why don't you start us off there? Hey there, Chief. Hey. Yo, what's up? Don't forget to follow Jay on Snapchat for the other videos that he does <laughs> with the bananas. And uh, <laughs> oh that God. is uh, that is Snapchat forward slash Jay's banana ace. Uh, today, I will be playing Seamus O'Neill and I... Do not put a banana up my asshole like Jay Potato at snapchat.com forward slash banana ass Jay. Just I whole potatoes. Just put whole potatoes. I really can't remember what we did last week, but I do know that we're going to the moon at the start of this episode. So <laughs> we're going to the moon. That's doesn't awesome. really matter. I really spit I my tanker with it. No, wait. I built <laughs> oh. everything but a bunk bed. Yeah, you no, you did build it correctly. Remember, technically, but I disassembled it, and yeah. then you disassembled it and reassembled it <laughs> elsewhere. Everyone thought I was gonna kill them last week. Everyone thought that I was gonna fucking murder the group, but Irish would never do that. He loves everyone here. Well, actually, Oops, sorry. He, he likes most people here a bit. I'll go with that. Probably the best he can go. Tucker's okay, at best. That's all I got for you. I like Thank you, Brad. That's it. Jay and probably Brad. Hello, guys. It's me and Brad. Uh, we did a dual stream today, so we're bringing it over here. Uh, on Snapchat. On Snapchat. That's, uh, we're, that's the, the triple stream later on. Wax going to join us for that. That's for our yeah. Patreon subs. We've uh, never done that before, but we, yeah. I believe it's possible if we get two yeah. bananas. I'll teach you, Brad. <laughs> if we keep them attached to the, uh, the thing, mm. and then we could probably do it. Honestly, the only oh. thing that holds me back, even 5%, is that Zakata, because his parents watch this stream sometimes. Because <laughs> it would be Boring. way worse. And I'd like to apologize to you oh. in Scottish, which is probably throwing knives at each other, I guess. Is that how you apologize in Scotland? Because it's definitely not with words, because you most of you probably don't even know any languages yet. <laughs> so I played Johnny Flash. The Johnny! <laughs> I'm he's just gonna the leave. Biggest, I'll be back toughest, later on. Forget it. The <laughs> largest. He's massive. He's got a size category of massive. Um, if you guys have watched Umbrella Academy, I think Johnny is as big as Luther. Except not nearly as tall. Just normal. Just, he's like just, five nine. Yeah, just five like... nine. Just the same width. <laughs> <laughs> um, and Johnny's one of a kind. He's a he's a muscly henchman. That's got uh, he's got a lot of brain, and a lot of love to give, guys. He's very loyal to this party builds bunk beds. Uh, he now has two new skills that everyone should watch out for. Uh, let me just pull them up for all of you so you can know what to watch out for. They are called, I believe one is Johnny Construction and Johnny Workout. So there's gonna be some big rolls that we're gonna be making this session, guys. When we go to the moon. Johnny. Any final comments on Jay's intro, Brad? 
Yeah, if you subscribe at tier three, Jay will change his official name on Twitch to Banana Ask Jay. Johnny at the end of it. Hi, yeah. Johnny. Jay, it'll be the letter J, just so that it covers all the bases. <laughs> Thank you, Brad and Jay. Uh, Katie and Brad. Hi, I'm Katie Peters Plays. I'm playing Lil Jambles. Plays what? Because it ain't fucking Waterdeep, uh, Lords of Waterdeep. <laughs> Let me tell you. It ain't the crap that. talking starts already. <laughs> I think you hustled us, by the way. I'm just going to give it He admitted it. He admitted it on stream today. Yeah. He admitted it on stream. He's like, yeah, I was playing yeah. stupid in the last turn. I had to make shit happen. <laughs> More like Katie play Peters got played. <laughs> Good one, Brad. <laughs> um, I play Lil Jambles, and um, I'm talking to my dad today. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Um, actually, I actually genuinely sent a fear spike up my spine that's how fucking invested i am in this campaign really so uh, i'll go and destroy it i'll shut up now <laughs> that's that that's all i'm gonna say i guess because if brad's gonna jump in he's gonna finish my sentence <laughs> so, <laughs> um yeah so little jambles things happening i computer stuff to them i computer things and put my eyes closed. <laughs> Thank you, Katie and Brad. Tosh and Brad. I'm a robot. All right, that's it. She is. <laughs> she is. Um, I'm a medic robot that doesn't heal people, but I do chop up bodies because it's practical to do that. And I have two knives, Brad. Tash is also from Yorkshire in uh, real life, which is about 1% better than Scotland. Yes. Uh, my mum's Scottish, so I'll take those insults. Sorry. That's, I'm the worst. That's one of the worst combinations you can get. It's all right. I could be you, which... Yeah. Ooh, I'm... there you go. <laughs> nice. I'm sorry. I had to. No, no. You don't apologize when you insult Brad. It's yeah, expected. No, this is no, how he lived his life. This is why he is the way that he is. Yeah. Yeah. No, that, was a, that, was a, that was a great joke. 10 out of 10 for your playground insult. <laughs> <laughs> You're a mom. Yeah. <laughs> I know you are. Set you up. Yeah, I know you are. <laughs> uh, I put, yeah, I, just, I play a minute robot that is just very confused a lot of the time. But I have my meat knives, my meat saw, so I'm good. I'm happy. That's it. Thank you, Tosh and Brad. Zagonicus and Brad. Hey, everybody. I'm Zagonicus. I play Tucker Marley, who is a, a, a father and uh, a guy who likes to fix things and tinker with things. And uh, and uh, he really doesn't like Johnny and Irish. Because they're a liability. Just like Brad. Yeah, I'll tell you what. I love this guy, though. Don't forget to go and head over to Zakatakus's new podcast at where is it? The Cotcast. It's only currently available on my Patreon for I'm into this and above level patrons, and then for all the I like this people, that's one dollar a month. You can get it there. Uh, Wednesday and it'll premiere on Twitch and on YouTube on Friday. And the first one's me and Vandy, and we talk about a bunch of stuff, including role playing and including how awesome Wax Steven is. Really? Bam. Yeah, we yeah don't sound it. surprised, okay? You, you know, I'm I'm working for Table Story for a reason, okay? Why the hell did I plug this podcast? Brad, Brad oh, went ahead you and he, you know, Damn. listen. I'm going to have to vet the plugs from now on. I have to check on our sponsors here. Listen, you do the hosting next time on the Shill Show. We'll see who wins there, bud, hey? Oh, well, yeah, hey. I was I thinking you very Jay, Except Brad is going to make probably. all of the all of the uh, bad things that, that can be done to us. They'll the just dollar. be about me. It's just going to be They're about me. Just be about Wang. Brad's like, we were saying we were saying that one of the reasons, realistically, that you lost last night was purely just because you were doing too much. It legit, to like legit. It's it's yeah. it's actually harder than running D and D. Like it to do the chill it's, shows, yeah. it's so it's much so harder. Yeah. It's so much so harder. We were like, there's so many I reasons. I had that bullshit. Because so you today, so right? forgot that he was like... You guys, I mean, like, I don't really get into it very much, but I'm just hyper-competitive. So, like, yeah. that's why I don't play any of those BR games. That's why I don't join you for that stuff. I can't 
handle that in a non-competitive level. My brain does not work that way, okay? It doesn't work that way. So if I'm not actually worried about the production, then I'm going to be like, I need to fucking kill all these motherfuckers in this game. <laughs> That's the way that my brain works. It's fucked up, and I don't like it. We'll but put you in. We'll, we'll be able to... You can use 1% of your power next time. I'll run yeah. the show show. Yeah. Um, shaggy. <laughs> uh, I am Wax Steven, and I will be the GM of Doom. I will be dragging these guys kicking and screaming through the adventure today. Um, if you guys have never seen the show before, this is Judge Dredd in the Worlds of 2000 AD that we are playing here, created by the wonderful Morris. He is our sponsor for the show as well. Please show some love to our wonderful sponsor, Morris. Head on over to the Patreon, uh, patreon.com slash morris, M-O-R-R-U-S, and morris.podbean.com, which is where you can check out the MP3 version of this show, as well as Crash City, which is going to have its finale coming up this uh, coming Saturday. Um, so hopefully we'll see you there for that. And uh, if you want to learn more about uh, Judge Dredd in general, um, you can head on over to the uh, Worlds of 2000 AD RPG uh, dot com website and uh, pick yourself up a book. We've got, uh, I mean, we're using it for this show, and um, we also use the Robot Wars um, uh, module, basically uh, the 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 one that came off of the Kickstarter with uh, with the Judge Dredd in general. And it was uh, it was pretty dope. It was pretty dope. We did uh, we the players are playing as uh, perps, and they're doing a very solid job of nailing the Judge Dread universe uh, perp mentality. It's almost like it was made for them. It was spot on. It's spot like on. I was made for Johnny. You are. You are Jay. You are. As Jay and Johnny the best are the insult ever. Man. Jay and Johnny are the be the same size IRL, same size. <laughs> the best insult. Yes. Beefcake. <laughs> so, um, last session, the players were, um, I guess, trying to regroup a little bit. Uh, Irish was very injured and was making his way back to the group in Little Jamble's apartment. While well, they were trying to figure out what to do next. Um, they have a whole lot of problems and not a lot of solutions. Um, and uh, they were debating on, well, dealing with uh, several different, um, I guess, several different uh, groups of people that were pretty upset with them. They basically pissed off every single person or group that they have met since they've uh, been in the Matt Damon block. And uh, they've just been racking up all these... Uh, well, bullseyes on themselves uh, as time has gone on. Um, just recently, uh, as Irish was badly injured in a value store riot, um, he, uh, he was making his way back to Little Jamble's apartment and managed to um, managed to meet her father in, uh, in an elevator uh, on the way back. He was sort of interrogated and intimidated into yeah. possibly I'm getting We're there gonna, relax well, relax uh, okay just uh, you come okay. yeah, very calm defensive of my boy I know you are I know uh, you are and that's why I have a mute button um, funny had five yeah. hours late <laughs> <laughs> and uh, her father offered uh, a whole lot of money to to Irish to uh, basically stay out of her life and um, encourage her other associates to stay out of her life by whatever means he deemed necessary. Um, <clears throat> little Jambles doesn't exactly have the greatest relationship with her father. He kicked her out uh, in the past. And uh, the whole thing's pretty confusing, I think, for Little Jambles in general. But um, Irish decided to tell the group and uh, steal the money that he made up front from Little Jamble's father. And uh, the group was considering moving out of the Matt Damon block, getting away from all of their problems, just running. And uh, there were some ads to possibly go to Luna One, a city on the moon. And um, Little Jamble's took it upon herself to try and uh, see if she could rectify some problems before they left. So she decided to call up her father at the end of the last episode. And that's where we're starting today. Mm. 
So, pick up the communicator and you contact your father. Mm -hmm. There's a few rings and you hear the click. Olivia? Hey, Dad. Dad, how's it going? It's cracking, Dad. Is there a reason for this call? Oh, Dad, I, well, okay, well, we haven't talked in a while, and I just thought, like, some stuff's happened. I just thought I would reach out. I noticed that you've been busy. There have been a lot of things happening recently. I see that you've taken advantage of my cleaning services. Well, I called Miss Joanne. She could have said no. She could have. So, I mean, I mean, it's really Miss Joanne's fault if you didn't want me to use the cleaners. So I was calling to say thank you because thank you for letting me use the cleaners. Is that the only reason that you're calling me right now? No, I mean, we also haven't seen each other in a while. So I thought, you know, maybe with like the robot stuff that happened and now this, maybe it would just be good to see each other, you know, just to like catch up. For what purpose? Oh, I'm sorry. I just thought that, you know, me being your daughter, you might want to, you know, see me. Since you sent Miss Joanne, uh, when the robot thingy happened, and then um, you could meet some of my friends. I could, I, there's a friend I could bring. You could meet one of my, my new friends. I have no desire to meet your friends. Why? I checked to see if you were still alive. You are. What? Okay, so like you don't, you don't want to see me? You've made some choices. Dad, Olivia. you kicked me out. Like, that's a thing. Like, you know, he, he I, I, I didn't really have a choice. So now maybe this isn't the life you wanted for me, but like, this is what I had to do. It was for your own good. And the choices that you've made since you have left the nest have not necessarily been any that I would agree with. You blackmailed me. You, you made sure that I couldn't get a job. Like, I couldn't do anything. I had to start doing what I've been doing. Also, how do you know what I've been doing? That's simply untrue. Well, why don't we get together and talk like adults? Dad. <sighs> Dad. Watch the tone a little bit. You wanted me to call him? I get weird around my dad, okay? Yeah, well, you just, uh, you know, don't be so snappy. Did you hear? You can... Dad, are you still there? I'm still here. Well, what do you, what do you say? I mean, I can come to you. You can come here. I mean, I got, I mean, there's the whole gang. The whole gang's here. I don't have any desire to meet your gang. Why? You have a gang. I can have a gang. Like, you're like... You don't know what you're talking about, Olivia. Look. If you want to have dinner tonight, that's fine. But just you. Oh. I don't want to speak with any of your so-called friends. Okay, I'll, I'll come. Where do I meet you? Your place, or do you want to go to a restaurant? I've always liked La Parisienne. Ooh, I kind of... Can we go somewhere else? Maybe a little more low-key? Low-key? Yeah, maybe someplace not there. I'm on a new diet. I don't want to eat their food. I mean, it's too rich. Give me a bluffing check, please. <laughs> 14. <clears throat> Where would you prefer? Oh, um... I'm not going anywhere below the 400th floor. Okay, um... How about... I don't know, you pick just someplace that's not there. I'll go anywhere else besides there.
All right, there's a molecular gastronomy restaurant on floor 487. All right, we'll go there. What's it called? It's called O2. Okay. O2 on 487. What time? Eight o'clock. Okay, uh, I'll be there. I won't bring my friends. So. I mean. Okay, hold on one second. Hold, hold on, Dad. What? I mean. You know we're gonna be there anyway, so why not just let them know that we're gonna be there anyway? Well, like, I mean, what's we? Is it you? Is it Irish and Johnny and Taskbar? We're just gonna you, roll up to O2, the molecular gastronomy restaurant, as a game? Do you, do you, do you it think could it could be nice? Those two to not come? I mean, how are you gonna Dad, do that? I, can't, I can't make any promises that I won't, that I'll be alone, but I'm gonna try really hard. Olivia, what have I told you about making decisions? Um, I, I can't remember. Maybe something like you just got to commit to your decisions. Yes. Okay, well, all right. Well, I'll show up. Sometimes they follow me. I'm going to come alone and commit to that. I'll see you at eight. Bye. I'm gonna hang up on him. <laughs> um, she's just like staring at her phone, breathing heavy. Were we all in the room for that? Or yeah, you, you okay. did it in the room, right? Yeah, I no, didn't we were out in the hall. It was okay. Taskbar and Tucker and I in the hallway, and Johnny and Irish. I think we're trying to build the bunk beds. I think we were oiling each other. Oh yeah, you were oiling each other in the background because yeah. we were talking about that. <laughs> um. Is it a good idea for you to go meet him? Well, it's not like he's gonna kill me. I mean, he, I get weird around my dad. He he was fine all growing up, and then one day I realized he wasn't who he said he was, and then things just got weird from there. So I just... Uh-huh. If I go alone, I don't know. What if he just, like, kills you all? Like, if you just come well, up behind me, just pop, 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 and well, then I'm just... Well, pay Irish to kill us all, so... He could do that while you're away, also. So, Maybe really, we're don't. safer where you can see us. Yeah. Oh, right. that's a good point. Yeah. Maybe you guys should come to dinner. Dad might like to meet you all. We can play off that we... Well, I don't know if I want to tell him that he Irish told us what happened. We could get our own table inside of yours. I mean, that's if probably you know... why he wants you to come alone, because he's expecting everyone else to be back here so the Irish can do the job. Something like that. Well, um, if you get another table, he's going to recognize Irish. Apparently, he's watching me and what we're getting up to. So it's not like you guys go get a table of a tabletop of four, and then he's like, oh, look at those random people at this O2 restaurant. Also, we don't really look like people who go to molecular gastronomy. Yeah. Just on a Tuesday. And he's probably going to. Yeah, he'd recognize that. It Irish. sounds cool. Johnny's not inconspicuous. I don't no. know exactly look like I fit in. Irish is loud. And, you know, you're a robot tax bar. Why'd you be at a restaurant? For the molecular ness science. Well, I mean, I was going to say maybe we should go ask Johnny and Irish their opinions, but. I mean, maybe they some Johnny sometimes gets a good Johnny idea. When? <laughs> Name one. Good. His... He's, he's really wanting to go to the moon, and it's starting to look more and more like a good option. Well, it's probably the furthest you can get away from your dad, and I doubt he's managed to set up any, uh... I mean, the colony's fairly new, so... I've always talked about leaving this place and starting a farm and I could do that on the moon. There's got to be a greenhouse to grow. Moon carrots. Moon carrots sound delicious. I mean, moon potatoes. Irish would like those. Wow. Way to throw that history in his face. Yeah, too but he's too soon. Loved- I've seen him. <laughs> 
I've seen how much he loves potatoes. He has, he, I mean, okay, well, anyway, let's, let's, I don't know. I gotta come up with the plan. I'm going inside. Uh, uh, you gonna go to the moon tax bar? What are you thinking? Sure, may as well. Nothing else here. So, could be fun. Plus, I don't need to breathe, so I can go explore. Yeah. I'm thinking I might just maybe move to De Niro block and keep my head down. One's a bit of a... Bit of a distance to move, merely, you know? I mean, so if you want to... De Niro block. Yeah, but it's stronger than the moon, at least. But there's also... Um... I don't know. Big Shad's not on the moon. Big yeah, Shad's not on the block either. He can move to other blocks too. Uh, well, when you're the kind of uh, thug that Shad is, you get a reputation, and uh, yeah, that, that's gonna make it hard for him to move around outside of the block, you know. And to the moon. The moon. I mean, I'm not gonna. I'm not saying you can't go. I'm just saying that. Uh, you should ask Millie. She's, she's not a baby. Yeah, but she's eight years old and hardly left. She's her bed definitely the gonna want to go to the moon. If I was yeah. an eight-year-old, I'd be like, "Let's go to the moon, Dad." Yeah, I mean, she likes it when she can get out of bed. You know what I mean? Like the moon's a Lower gravity means I, that it would be easier for I can't get you know, something like that. I mean, there's no guarantee they'll have the medicine we need up there, or it'll be, it's probably more expensive. I mean, the medicine for Millie cost me more than my rent, you know? It's like double what I pay for rent, I pay for her medicine. And with the winnings, I'll be able to, I mean, I won't need to work anything big for a while, and I can just do little jobs here and there, selling uh, toys and stuff, and we'll get by for, for a good while until something good comes up. Maybe I can get a real job again. Maybe I can get some money from my dad. Could you get me a job with your dad? I mean, I... I'm gonna be honest, that's kind of why I wanted to meet him. You guys got what? connections, clearly, and... Why didn't you tell me this before I called him? I wouldn't, I mean, at this point, I'm just, now I have to go to dinner with my dad and all you wanted to do was get a job? I wasn't sure how you were gonna react, so I just kind of kept it to myself, but. Also, he did try murder us, so maybe yeah. this is good to not be murdered. But if I can get a job with him, clearly it pays well, he gave Irish all that money. You give Irish that money. Imagine how much you give me. <laughs> to murder us? That's not No, nice. no, to like drive and fix stuff and whatever else he needs. I mean I'm 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 good with stuff. Fix problems like her friends. No, like TV not working and stuff. Well, you're considered the group of people that he sent Irish to kill, so I really don't think he's gonna be like, Oh, you can drive a car? Sweet. Oh, well, maybe if... I mean, I, I only just... Maybe he doesn't know about me yet. I only just met you recently. You know what I mean? Like, what, how many days ago? Two? Some. Three? Yeah, so how can I vouch for you? I mean, that's why I was kind of hoping to meet him. I think I could make a good impression myself. Well, you come right on into the restaurant and say, hi, I'm Tucker Morley, and shake his hand, and you tell me how that goes. Well, I'll watch how it goes, because I don't think it's going to go well. That's kind of why I wanted to go. I mean, I'm feeling some animosity here. I just Ooh. feel like there's flaws in this plan. I need to go pick out an outfit for tonight. There's so no plan. I, I got to go inside and get an outfit, because my dad only expects, I mean, we're going to a fancy restaurant, I'll be, and I just rush inside. Inside. Well, I was what, in the hall. What, what does little Jambles see? No, I know where you were. Oh. What does little Jambles see, uh, Irish and Johnny, when she walks in? 
Uh, uh, I have a banana, <laughs> and it's it is covered in uh, oil. And Johnny's trying to use it as a screwdriver to build the bunk beds. And we and that's it. Yeah, he's building a bunk Johnny, bed. Uh, please roll me. Uh, oil. Give me a construction roll, please, Johnny. Oh yeah, as Johnny's working on this. Uh, and this is gonna be plus your uh, logic. Five. <laughs> Using this banana. Iris, Johnny read on the internet thing that uh, the moon is earthquakes. Do you know that? Uh, that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. just go to my really closet. Cool. Gambles, did and you know I... the moon has earthquakes? Johnny read it. The, um, it has... the bookcase, by the way, or the bunk beds, uh, I think look somehow like a lamp at this point. It's, it looks like a lamp. I don't even know how Johnny did it. It's coming together. Yeah, I mean, someday it'd be nice if we could put like the two mattresses on it. That would be so cool. Oh. I, gotta, I gotta go pick up, well, you guys, I, and I'm all flustered and I start like rummaging through my drawers and oh, stuff. Johnny forgot the mattresses. The mattresses have to go on. How could Johnny forget that? Maybe I should uh, I should help you pick something out, Jamble. There's so many like pieces of your clothing, by the way, that have like grease on them. Irish, have you been in my drawers? Oh, I've tried on all those dresses. Why? I need I need a clean dress for tonight. Tucker, help me find one that doesn't have. Oh, I didn't admit it. I've seen that out of character. Oh. <laughs> in character, I would never admit this to you because you look scared. Uh, no, remember when he was looking for a T-shirt? He just looked through all your shit. Like he was looking through everything. Oh yeah. my god, dude. No, but for real, Irish has definitely put on whatever dress she's looking for, or whatever she said she was looking for. Next whatever that project, is. Void Smoker. Has been worn <laughs> by Irish while everyone else was asleep. There's probably like, can we flash back to like a couple nights ago when everyone else was asleep and Irish is just using Jamble's toothbrush and wearing her dress and just like like humming Ooh. to himself in the in the bathroom. Like the dress doesn't flashes. fit. Like, like, yeah, 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 yeah. And he's just like, ah, 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 ah. and then it flashes back. <laughs> <laughs> Flash forward again. Yeah, let's uh, separate them into Beyond Hope, my bed was save it and clean. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll I'll see. I don't know how this grease got all over everything. I mean, give me a I've never... uh, give me oh. a perception check, and you can use your. Um, do you have the perception skill, little jambles? Um, I do. Okay, yes. you can use luck in place of intuition for that. For this, but my intuition's higher. Unfortunate. <laughs> so should I switch it to luck? Yeah. That's a twelve. Um. Okay. Um. So there's a. Uh, there's at least like six outfits that have been completely ruined. I mean, there is no hope for them. Um, <clears throat> did, did someone use these as a towel or something? There are. Uh, Morning, Johnny. Yeah, there are uh, four that are salvageable, and two are actually uh, okay. Those, those are the. What happened to my clothes, Tucker? Did you see? I mean, I've never. Like the I, seams I have to on the clothes. sides are all broken, you know. Like, I mean, <laughs> if you've ever uh, lent anybody that's like way bigger than you, like a piece of clothing before, it's all stretched out and like. I mean. It does look why like. Why don't you just take a guess? Towel. Yeah. But how? Irish, Johnny, have you guys like messed with my clothes? I won't be mad. No. Only no. that one time. Just that one time. No, Johnny had to steal some socks. I for a workout. What? Irish, Johnny, do you know where the towels time. are? Do you know where the towels are in here? Can you point to no. them? No. No. Johnny didn't, Johnny didn't know where the towels were. Oh. So, so how have you been wiping off the oil and, and socks. drying off in socks? Right. Socks. Yeah. Whose socks? Who? Pointing at Jambles. <laughs> I'm just pointing okay. out the area where all of your clothes are. Yeah. Oh, all right. Everything's yeah. suck. Mm -hmm. Guys, we, I whispered to Tucker. Yeah, like move we can't the couch buy any more bit. oil. We need to get. The, our, we have to. They they can't have any more oil. It's ruining my clothes. I have to go shopping now and get more clothes. Don't I mean, you're I'm not, shopping? No, no not no, today. No, 
No, we gotta go we shopping. Need more oil. Johnny, Johnny thinks we do have to go shopping. There's no mattresses. We we don't. Out of oil. No, Unless we cut your on. mattress in half, Jambles. Johnny thinks we could cut your mattress in half and then. I'm not the going with beds. Irish. Uh, okay, Tucker, do either of these work or do I need to go get something on the way tonight? Because I don't know. <laughs> uh. Well, why don't you try them? Try them on. I'll, I'll okay. Um, what do you think, Little Jamble's favorite color is? Are you asking me or yeah? I'm else? asking you. Oh, her favorite color is probably like. I mean, honestly, black. Okay. Yeah, she's she likes black, dark okay. colors. Okay. Um, I'll tell you what. I want you to roll me a one d six. Okay, just roll me a flat one d six. Six is the ideal situation. Okay. Let's see what what outfits you have left. Okay, these are the outfits that you like wore. Uh, that you maybe you bought like on, on at, like just on a whim. Like you mm -hmm. saw them and they were on sale and like ah, what the hell? And this is this is like um, I want to say this is like totally out of style at this point. Like it's just not. You're trying to like do some mental math. Can I combine these in some way? Um, it's like. <laughs> Some kind of weird half pants thing. They look Gun like giant yellow with the fluffy, puffy shoulders. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got like a puffy Stomach. shoulder on one side, yeah. and there's some kind of frilly thing over here. Yeah, you know, why don't you try them on and just? And the other we'll one see. is a wedding dress. <laughs> <laughs> no, it can't be because that 100% Irish would have wore. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, I put on the first, I go into the bathroom, I change, and I put on the first outfit. Okay. I mean, the sleeves are a little big. Yeah. But. Yeah. yeah. Don't you, why don't you put on something else? Yeah. yeah hang I on. Don't... It's great. Uh, You've got loads of clothes. I got to use the bathroom real quick. I you fall off a here. building with that, you okay. can open it up Shut like a jacket. Uh, fly true, like a yeah. sugar squirrel. Uh, well, I'm in the bathroom. Bad clothes. I, I'm going to, I'm going to pick up Jambo's phone and try and. I'm gonna copy your dad's number off it. <laughs> oh, Ooh, nice. oh. give me a thievery check. Do you have thievery or sleight of hand? I feel like Jambles' but phone I mean, would have a ton of like locks. She left her, I do too. I, I just assumed she left her. She uh, left it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But get, do you have anything that might help you with this check? Uh, I got computers. Okay, give me a computer's roll. Uh, it's going to be harder than if you had, like, electronics or something. I've got electronics. Oh, you do? Okay, give me yeah. an electronics roll, uh, plus your logic here. Let's see if you can get through. Uh, little Jambles, give me a um, give me a computer's roll, uh, plus oh, your no. logic. <laughs> All right. Wait, can I replenish my luck? <laughs> oh, I mean, oh, 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 oh that's 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 you got three ones go, in though. there. Oh, oh, no. oh it's possible. A 19, a, a 19 on little Jamble's phone. Okay. That hurts. All right, my electronics roll. That's a nine. <laughs> I was hoping you would roll. So and there's like a what happens is, as soon as you like pick up her phone, um, oh my God. as soon as you pick up her phone, uh, and you like try to access it, her communicator, it'll basically you hear this like. Burr, burr, uh, oops! <clears throat> I little throw jambles. The door open. Little jambles. What's your favorite uh, television show? The Expanse. Oh, little jambles. Oh, I thought you were asking for me. <laughs> Sorry. Go oh, oh God. Her favorite show, definitely Golden Girls. Okay. Thank you for being my friend. Thank you for being my friend. I throw the door. Open. Travel down the road and back again. What like <laughs> did you do? <laughs> uh, I just picked it up to move. Thank it you for I... being my friend. It's just getting louder and louder. You don't just pick this up to move it and Golden Girls theme plays. That's I, a special I, alarm. I, I, it, I turn off I the mean, alarm. Is there also? Oh, were you trying to do? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it totally took a picture of him. Like, oh, it's, no, it's like this. It's like a <laughs> over my shoulder at the door. Like, I, uh, um, all right. So, what what can I help you with, Tucker? Because at this point, I just kind of want you to leave. Damn. <sighs> I was just trying to get your dad's number. That's all. I've been honest with you. You uh -huh. should be honest with me, Tucker. 
I'm being honest, that's what I was looking for, just trying to get his number. That's it. I mean, you got, it's clear you got a kind of tense relationship, and I just thought, yeah, I just... Oh, so good old Tucker Morley calling up my dad. Hi, I'm a friend of Olivia's. That's going to go over real good. I mean, I was just... I'd figure it out down the line. I was just... I'll find my own outfit. And I just walk out of the bathroom. Um, She, like, walks off. There's, like... She's got, like, a puffy, like, pink and brown (laughs) tutu on or something. And she, like, puts her hands on her hips and walks off. It's all, like, floofing as she moves. I'm going to text my dad, too, and ask him to change the restaurant. Uh... And what was that Guy Fieri restaurant? <laughs> oh, God, I can't remember. Oh, man. <laughs> I did not keep I that like, note. Uh, um, chat, help us. What was it called? It was like... Um, it is a play on diners, drive-ins, and dives. I can't remember the name though. That was one that Ketchup freeze? met the guy in, right? That was like the second episode. Oh god, that's so long ago. I don't remember. Yeah. I didn't write that one down. But I'll. It's not Cinco Muchacho. <laughs> I'll. <laughs> I'll just recommend that restaurant. Cinco it... Muchachos. <laughs> that means five guys in Spanish, by the way. <laughs> And pretend you can speak Spanish. Don't worry, Brad. He didn't. <laughs> I was just catching everybody else up, you know, in case anyone didn't know. Yeah. So, so okay, so you're going to text your dad. Um, okay. Yeah, he's going to he's gonna text back. Reservations have already been made. I'm going to text it back and say location has been compromised. He's going to call you. Okay, I go out into the hall. Olivia, what is Help going on? Okay, I'll just be honest with you, Dad. There's a guy, and he wants to meet you for a job, and he knows where we're going for dinner, and I can't promise that he won't show up. Why does he know where we're going for dinner? He was in the hall when I called you. Because he's part of my gang. But I'm kind of debating if he's going to be part of my gang because he kind of tried to get your number off my phone. Olivia, but I, I ha- do yes. I ever, have I ever, in the past, wanted to know this kind of information before? No, which is probably why we don't have a good relationship. <laughs> you are testing my patience, Olivia. Okay, well, you can meet me for dinner, or we could just never talk again. So, it's up to you. We can go to Cinco Muchachos if you want. I have problems with Mexican food, no. Okay, how about, um... Uh, I don't know, a Gary's Deli. Gary's Deli? Yeah, it's on one of the lower floors. You're, I mean, I already know you're not going to like it. I already told you I'm not going below floor 400 for this. What about, um, what about Sings? Sings? What is that? <laughs> it's like a, it's like a bar, coffee house. No. Karaoke. Okay, okay. Um, how about the dragon on three eighty? I know it's on. I know it's below four hundred, but it's still nice. Roll me a uh, charisma check or a reputation check if you have something that might help you with this. You can try and add that as a skill. I don't think you do. Mm mm. That's an 11. No. Okay. Listen, um, we'll go to yeah. Persephone. Okay. What floor is that one on again? 432. All right. I will be there. 
fine. I'll I'm make new you. reservations. And please, Olivia, don't yeah. mess this up. I'm, I mean, what's... Okay, we'll talk He later. hangs up on we'll you. Oh, damn it. I go back inside. Everything's all set for O2 later tonight. Listen, Jambles, I, I We're shouldn't... On the moon? There's oxygen. There's actually no oxygen on the moon. Johnny looked it up. I, yeah. I shouldn't have done that. That was wrong of me, but... I mean, you understand, right? I'm... I'm just trying to do whatever I can, you know? So am I, but I'm not doing shady stuff. You, yeah, we so are. But you, yeah. you, 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 yeah. You, yeah, I got. I mean, what do you think happened when shady stuff? When, when those trucks that you hacked crashed and exploded? What do you think happened? Every time there? you look back behind Johnny and Irish, by the way, it's a new configuration for the for the bunk beds. And when Johnny's uh, thinking, at this point, like, it looks like a jungle gym. So he's just yeah. like flexing and like. I mean, that, it's not that I'm not grateful, but but you're responsible for people's deaths. Just yeah. Completely. See, that's oh, yeah, the thing. Shady stuff in general that. is fine, but I mean, shady stuff amongst us. I mean, even Irish told me that he was sent to kill all of us. So like, yeah, you're trying think. to get on my phone. You're well, trying to like right, talk about uh, well, that. Uh, yeah, you don't and I'm uh, phone. And yeah. also, Irish tried to get me stampeded. Yeah, see, there's that. We're all not perfect apart from me. So there's that. That's what happens when you are a human-ish. Yeah, but, uh, but yeah. I admit it was wrong. I'm not like saying it's right to, to do it. Together. Wouldn't be hard to do. Yeah, I, I'm not saying yeah. I'm in the right. Good. It was wrong. Lego. No, I... that was outlawed, probably, because it's stupid. I, I should have so. talked to you, Jambles. That's what I should have <laughs> done. Put you back together. Did you guys but, know that the moon is slowly getting farther from Earth? Can we maybe yeah. step outside and have a conversation with him? Has kicked you Tucker wanna... out, so Tucker's not coming back, which is. I a shame. think we should have a conversation in here. Yeah. Well, well it's really yeah. hard. But we'll with... learn about the moon. Yeah, I won't st send any more stampedes over well, you if Tucker's not around to put you back together again. Then. Yeah. Well, how about just no stampedes would be great, and I won't tell everyone about all those pies you ate. Ha ha ha. Mm. Let's just do a vote. Who I wants imagine. to go to the moon? Johnny loves the moon. I, I raise my hand. Oh, well, that uh, works out okay then. So everyone except fire. Tucker raised their hand. Why don't you like the moon? Other than, obviously, it's yeah. very far away. And it could be cold. Johnny read that it was pretty cold. But, I think uh, it'll be fine. He's got nice it's warm. warm stuff. Are you guys, Tucker? Because I know you want to go. Hey, okay. Johnny's trying to sell the moon. Okay. Task yeah. Four. Um. Okay. Maybe oh, look nerd. how good you're doing Point with building that. Here are the instructions. Thank you. Yeah, Johnny. Johnny's getting it. Well, if you're gonna go to the moon, then I guess. Uh, I guess we're parting ways then. Either See? way. So then, I'm sure there'll be other opportunities. I can't even guarantee my dad would give you a job. I also don't think you want to work for him. You're gonna get a job, Tucker. That's awesome. Well, I'm trying to do something. Yeah. It's everything I do, uh, d driving cars and people dying and, and yeah. dealing stuff and building stuff and fixing stuff, it, it's it's means to an end. I'll do anything to reach that end, and that ends Definitely. making sure that, that Millie's happy, you know? You're you going to get a legit Red. job. You know what Johnny Red Tucker? I've tried. Legit, there's well, cars on the moon. You could drive right. on the moon. Um, they, yeah. There's lots of building and job He's, opportunities it's as they point. expect. I can, I can work out, can lift even bigger weights, can finally pass the 450 for the bench. We're going to the moon. Come on, Tucker. We could make sure you have a job before we go. Yeah. Well, that's kind of what I was trying to do, car. but I, I... On... I think she uh, means on the moon. Yeah. I, but on then... On the moon? On the moon. Why don't we like yeah, talk to somebody about the moon? Maybe there is like a like a system. There has to be a hospital up there for Johnny Millie. Has an idea. Right, but how um, expensive do you there. think a hospital on Luna One is going to be? Like a brand new, basically colony with that all. Doesn't matter. We can sell moon rocks. Johnny and Irish are strong enough to pick them up. We we pick well, up. I'll be there, and the I could also work in yeah. the hospital and on Millie. It's not oh, like no, I need sleep. To do that. She's it's far too, too young. It, it, plastic it's surgery. Just, it's too much risk. I can't, I can't, I can't take that risk. 
I mean, all goes well, Millie's fine, but if I move her up there, then and it all yeah. goes wrong, I lose my little girl. Who knows? It's risky, it's risky here, risky. too. Fine, right, yeah. but if I stay here, I've got. You got oxygen, soda, Wind. and, That's you know, soda. Meredith's here, and. and well, I really she's in a box. Meredith would like the moon. So. Johnny knows no, that. that, that oh, was for him. Uh, Taco's well, going to be in a box. There's as well. also Shad and. Yeah. Who else knows yeah, what I'm else? Die. Yeah, Chad's probably gonna get himself killed in the block wars, no doubt. Hopefully, maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll move Meredith and and Millie and leave them with the money, and then uh, maybe I'll just take care of Chad myself and Tucker. Let it, let that be that. Yeah. Got a big um, idea. Greg's place is still open. Yeah. Yeah. Just put Chad in there. Yeah, no, I'm walking from Greg's place <laughs> to go to the moon. <laughs> I'm thinking, I, I think in another block's good enough. Uh, you can't, uh, you can't just be affiliated with a gang in one block and just go to the other and be fine for the most part. I'll be all right because I keep my head down. So, what time is it? It's uh, Johnny time. It's Johnny Sorry. time, everybody. Yeah. Uh, I'd say it's probably late afternoon. Probably like oh. four o'clock. I have a lot more time than I thought. Um, does this look okay? Yeah. No. no. Yeah. No. Absolutely. No. Johnny. Johnny loves says. It. Johnny says it looks nice. Johnny, Johnny take says your a off lot of look. things. What God kind of horrific look. ensemble has? has been put together here yeah johnny still likes it it's definitely yeah. like tooled out brown striped with pink skirt and a hot neon yellow crop top oh, with wow. floofy sleeves because it's all that was clean <laughs> do you need medical yeah. attention because i I'm worried for your brain. Johnny Doesn't does. it go a little bit fun. like it's very, it's very avant-garde? Like I can no. pull it off. No. Right? Yeah. No, no, you've not got the face to pull off avant-garde. Uh, I think if you're confident enough, you can. It, I mean, it doesn't really matter, right? Well, do I'm I, a robot, dinner? and I say no. Uh, yeah. Do I need to go get something? I mean, yeah. there's yes. Avant-garde. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm. Don't forget to I bring your dad milk and bread. I see hey, a Greg it's was creaking. Maybe he Billy's had one of like your clothes. Maybe your dad likes butterscotch. Did you say Greg might have had some of my clothes? I don't know, but he was creepy, right? I mean, it's yeah. worth a shot, to be honest, because it's either I go shopping or I I can check Greg's. Do you really want Jim, Greg's? Find the train. <gasps> Irish, the oh, train. no. The train. You don't want Greg's clothes. No, I no, think it, that's a good idea. You'd have yeah. to wash them a lot. Yeah, it's not going to be a T-shirt either. It's going to be something else. And who knows if the smell will ever wash out. Yeah. Okay, well, I got to I gotta go to you the store then. I, I mean, is there, any, is there any on my floor, Whack? Are there any... <laughs> Are there any shops on your floor? Yeah, like any nicer shops, or not a nicer shop, but a shop that would have a dress. Um, yeah, there's definitely like a shop that would have like dresses or something. It's probably like a little outlet store. Does it have a name? Um, it definitely has a name. Never worn a dress before either, apart from it like forced. Conventions uh, of it's called uh, Raven Twenty One. Home. <laughs> okay, there, there's the Raven Twenty One on my. Floor. Yeah, you probably oh. like it there. What, what is that supposed to mean, Irish? Because you like black. Oh, oh, okay. I thought it meant something else. I'm gonna. I guess I gotta go get a dress. What did you so. Think? Yeah. yeah. Well, he said I didn't have the face to pull off avant-garde, so I wasn't really sure what it could mean. So... Yeah. You'd be better well, off in a pair of flats and a nice black hoodie. At least yeah. he's honest. Good workout clothes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. In case you and your dad want to work out, you know, get a, a session. No, not got the legs for years. Yeah. I mean, Johnny are you going to connect with his dad, with Ronnie. Are you still going to go meet with him? Yeah. Why? Because he's my dad. I mean, right, but you're running away from home again, right? You're going to the moon, so again, I'm to go meet with him. Oh, right, he kid you. Sorry. 
I'm going to Raven 21. Um, I'll be back. Then I go out. Uh, you want Johnny to come? Yeah, go, go with Johnny. Yeah, Johnny loves shopping. Can you can you look after Johnny there yourself? What? Bye, Tucker. Yeah. And I walk. Johnny's got a lot of body. Everyone can see it. Of course, he can keep an eye on himself. Duh. Close the door. <sighs> yeah, shopping. Yeah, I mean, yeah. you're the only one who seems to like this outfit, so maybe you can help yeah. me find something a little yeah. less, Johnny less intense. Yeah, well, I'm, it's no one else did, though, Johnny. I mean, I thought I could make it work tonight, but... Jambles, nobody's got Johnny's taste. I know. It's the reason they call the Johnny the Johnny. You okay, know. well, you can help me pick out something, and then... Yeah, yeah. We should throw some blue into this. Johnny thinks maybe some well, neon orange. Well, I think I have to get rid of the whole outfit. I think oh, it was too much yeah. for everybody. Yeah, some nice workout shorts, maybe a tank top, and then put a dress over over top, you know, in case yeah. your dad want to work out, get a session, right? Gets the blood pumping, like Johnny yeah, said. Yeah, my dad and I are definitely gonna definitely gonna go on a jog after. Yeah, yeah. Just give Johnny a call if you guys need a workout trainer. You know, Johnny's always there for you. Okay. No, yeah. I appreciate that, Johnny. Maybe on the moon you can help whip me into shape finally. Well, I can't wait to run on the moon. So when we get to Raven 21, is it, is it so like all So just to be black? clear, you did, you, you are going, Johnny. It's, yeah, it's, yeah, Johnny's yeah. going. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So uh, Raven 21, it's about what you'd expect. Um, it's, it's a very goth looking kind of store. Um, and uh, yeah, there's a lot of like black clothing and stuff. Lots of sort of, um, uh, you know, like, big platform shoes and you know yeah. it's got that like aesthetic mesh um thing yeah. yeah yeah okay i just grabbed the first black dress i see okay when you go into the store uh johnny you recognize somebody oh. immediately who is this um wearing some of this uh black attire but looking really out of place is somebody that kind of looks similar to Johnny. Um, she's taller than Johnny. Johnny, however. And she's got this, like, weird... Um, I think she's got, like, a... Uh, she's got a... Uh, oh, God, a corset. She's got, like, a corset on. But it, oh, it looks like it's not really fitting right. Now, Johnny, you know why this is the case. Um, this is a patron NPC, by the way, coming in from Micro Fellatio. Um, this is your sister, Leonarda. Um, and Body! you know, you know why uh, she's wearing this corset. Uh, it's weird to see her out, in, out like in public, um, but she usually covers up the fact that she has three boobs. Um, she is in fact a mutant, that, Lonnie? and uh, her nickname is Spain. Uh oh, did we lose Brad? We lost we got, Brad. Oh got, no! Oh, no, Brad, Brad screwed Brad. everything oh, up. We have six, back, seven. Back. Sorry. Um, the have multiplied. Yeah. Look at that face. That's the other one from the well. What is happening? Uh, Zagaticus, <laughs> hop on the oh, end there again, you go. please. Thank you. Uh, you missed. You, you disconnected from the Zoom call and came back. Um, so yeah, her nickname is Spain. I don't know why. <laughs> Johnny calls her Lonnie. Just thanks. okay. No, she Spain. says, Lonnie. "Oh." Johnny, what are you doing here? Lonnie! It's Johnny! It's the Johnny! I can see it's you, Johnny. What are you doing Johnny. here? Johnny, Lonnie! Lonnie, John! This is Johnny's sister. Lonnie, Leonardo. Oh, Johnny. Hi. You can call it's me nice. Spain. Yeah. It's nice to meet you, Spain. Lonnie, it's so good oh. to see you. God, you've gotten so buff and big. Thanks. Wow. They told me to hide wow. everything with the corset, but, uh... Yeah? I just... It just, it's just—it's really—it's really frustrating, yeah. you know. Yeah, yeah, the old trip nip. Yeah, Lonnie's got three nipples. Can we not talk about them, that in public, please, sorry. Johnny? Sorry. Yeah, sorry. Johnny forgot. Yeah, Lonnie doesn't have three nipples. Never mind. Johnny's she's got. got uh, she's got like um, black hair um, that's kind of quite obviously been dyed. Um, like it's it's not a good dye job at all, and um, it's just. Yeah, she's just she's she looks a little greasy wherever you can yeah. see the skin. She's overly tanned as well, sort of similar a little bit. Johnny, love you done. Yeah, love the hair. Love hey, thanks. I just Amazing. did it the other day. I got a yeah. new job. Yeah, Johnny's got it. You got a job? Wow. Where? Yeah, here. No way. No way. Yeah. Jambles. 
Yeah. 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 Can we get a discount? Lonnie, you gotta give Johnny a discount. Come on, I said Johnny. Well, I can get a discount. Maybe I could get your discount. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Jambles, see? Woo. Well, I, I didn't know you had a sibling, Johnny. Yeah. So it's, oh, it's... yeah. Johnny's got a sibling. Johnny's got a mom. Dad? Grandpa? Oh, not anymore. Poor old Gramps last year. It's, well, it's nice Crazy. to meet you, Lonnie. Yeah. Yeah. Nice to uh, nice to know that Johnny's uh, got himself a girlfriend. Yeah. No. No. I, yeah. no we're no. engaged. No, we're not. You and Billy were engaged. No. Were engaged. Okay. I was engaged she at was one engaged. point, but Billy wasn't. Billy was not. Chimpanzee. You it's know, it's really rude of you to forget your uh, your other sister as well, Johnny. Yeah. So sorry. What? How many siblings do you have? Here? No. Oh. oh. Beatrice isn't here. Bonnie? No way. Where is she though? She get a job too? No. She's still at home. Oh, Bonnie. She's looking after Johnny. Oh, Johnny Jr. Oh, what a boy. Or Johnny Sr. Johnny oh. Jr. Johnny Jr. You should see Johnny Jr. Jambles. He's almost as tall as Johnny. He's oh only my. eight. He's, wow. he's seven years old, Johnny. Seven. It, that's Bonnie's son? B. It's B Beatrice. Oh, sorry. Be Bonnie, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Sorry. Um, uh, uh, Spain, do you have any recommendations for like a nice evening dress that I of could Of course. Just... Look around. This place is great. Okay. Do you have yeah. any like any yeah. favorites? Anything that you just like go, wow, I like that. that would Okay. That's Try good too. Oh. Whoa. All right. Um, I See? I grab one of each and I go to I'm going to go try these on. I will be right back. Yeah. Yeah, see you soon. Johnny will be right here. We'll be here. Yeah. Oh. See this? Bonnie. Bonnie. Look. Sorry. Look at Johnny's biceps. It'll get bigger one day. Johnny's getting a bicep on his bicep, almost like you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Johnny loves that. Wow. You're always the biggest in the family. Oh, my goodness. Johnny everyone everyone Google Scott Steiner right now. Oh, man. <laughs> he's Good. got those super peak biceps yeah. that look like he's got some kind yes. of weird cancerous growth on them. <laughs> And thick vein oh my mm. god dude dude's vein is bigger than his lips jeez yeah wow what are you doing nowadays how, how much do you lift four or five hundred wow johnny's going to the moon so johnny's gonna hit that depends on what i'm lifting you know what do you mean well if i have to lift 400 500 i'll do it yeah yeah what else then car no problem wow johnny got a bike once we can't I was, was on the road the other day, had a truck. We were driving it. It was crazy. Lonnie, let me tell you, Johnny had a rocket launcher. Johnny now owns a rocket launcher. No, you didn't. I met a guy. You didn't have a rocket friend. launcher. No, no. Johnny's no, you got didn't. a rocket launcher. No, no, you didn't. Let me tell you, Johnny's got no, you it. Didn't. Johnny fired it no, you didn't. out of the truck. Enough of the stories, Johnny. The no, I've no, got no. enough of the stories. That's how it is. No, Johnny swears. No. Okay? Johnny swears no. on mom. Okay? Okay? Don't yeah. swear on mom. What? You swear on mom all the time. Why can't Johnny swear on mom? When you get older. What? Just because you're older doesn't mean Johnny can't swear on mom. Yes, but Johnny can swear on Johnny swear on the shirt right now. Johnny, I'll do it. I swear on the shirt. Johnny had a rocket launcher. Shirt's not mom. Johnny will buy it. Give it to you. I like that shirt. Yeah, Johnny likes it too. Johnny's gonna buy it for you. What did Johnny? That's a nice gift. What does Johnny buy? It? Right here. Right there. Money. Right here. Do you like walks behind the register? <laughs> How can I help you, sir? Uh, Johnny's here to buy the shirt for you. That would be a very nice gift. Yeah. Possibly Johnny for thinks. a family member. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. You never know. I'm going to tap the credit stick. <laughs> Pass it to her. She puts it in a bag, like looking She's at you the get whole that time. I think the wrapping was very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good choice. Johnny thinks he'd like it. Oh, look at that. Johnny got you a shirt. Ha. Wow. Best brother ever. Yeah, thanks. Best sister. Oh. High five. High five. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best. That was so good. <laughs> oh my god. I wish you. <laughs> I love this show. So, um,. You grab yourself a Jess, a uh, little jambles while the uh, <laughs> while the family moment is happening, <laughs> and uh, go ahead and uh, roll me a roll me a luck pool check, please. Let's see if you can put something together with this. Okay. 
your luck dice pool. A four. Okay. Um, it's better than what you had, mm -hmm. but it's definitely a certain style. It's a little goth. I mean, that's okay. kind of what this place is. J Johnny, Johnny, what do you think? I mean, I'm, Irish got me that makeup. Maybe I can like, yeah, yeah. J judge myself Spain, up. I don't Spain, know. Spain like looks over the the side of Johnny. It's fantastic. You look great. Yeah, Johnny likes it. That's okay, perfect it, for you. This is, yeah. It's good. Is it better yeah. than what I had Johnny, on? Just, Definitely. You got the face for it. Yeah. Doesn't she have the face oh. for it? Hey, thank you. Face goes perfect with the dress. Yeah. Thank yeah. You. yeah. Thank Much you, better than. You I want some makeup off. too? Oh no, I, I actually got some. Thank you though. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, Johnny's gonna get this for task four. Well, do you have, do you have like a lipstick or something? Maybe I should. Of course. Have lipstick. But Johnny's holding lipstick. Okay, she well, quickly holds you? lipstick and everything up. Yeah. Okay, I'll take. I'll, oh wait, is yeah. it just black and like? No, this one's red. Number six ninety. There's black and midnight noir. I'll take midnight noir because that's like a little red. I'll take yeah. that one. Yeah, that's a good choice. Okay, and then um. All right, so can I just pay you while I'm wearing this, or do I need to go put my other stuff back on? Yeah, don't worry. Johnny's already got it. What? No, I can do take care of it, Johnny. Johnny, pop a guy out. How? How much is it? Uh, altogether it comes to uh, 145 credits. Nope, never mind. Jamble's got it. Oh, that's a, for this? Like for the? For the skirt, for the top, for the shoes. Do you want the collar too? No, I'll leave the collar. I'll, I can, I can not have the collar. I'll. What about a corset? I'll, she holds one up. It's no, like, where I is mean, she is getting cheaper? this from? Wait, how much is the corset? Is that cheaper than the shirt? It's definitely not cheaper, but I think it looked better on you. Maybe hike the boobs up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, honestly, okay, I'll take that. Okay, how much is that? Uh. The corset runs uh, 445 credits. Wow. Oh, um, maybe, okay, maybe not. I can. I'll find a bra. Jambles, you can pay for that. Yep. You have like a million. No, I mean, I really don't. I kind of no. spent it all on the bunk beds. And Whoa. so... Would you like the Nocturne I... bra? Do you have a Kevlar corset? Kevlar corset? Yeah. I can probably order one. Well, do you have one in stock? No. Oh. Hmm. Is there a Kevlar okay. dress? No. Okay. Not um, enough. enough. Well, how much is the bra? The bra? Yeah. 54 credits. I'll take oh, it. That's nice. Johnny can grab that yeah. one. Oh, okay. Thank, thanks, Johnny. Yeah, the Johnny's got you. Don't worry. Thank you for buying me yeah. a bra. Johnny's um, in a okay. good mood today. Yo, I appreciate it. Okay, yeah. so how much do I owe you? All together? It's uh, 123 credits. Oh, okay. All right, perfect. Um, Here's my cred stick. Yeah, without the without the shoes, which I would like to add, really tie the whole outfit together. Yeah. 123 credits. They make you taller than Johnny. Okay, and then how much? Okay, the shoes add it's how much? It's not very hard. Listen. Look at these traps, okay? Look at these they traps. Go. Oh! God, they had like six feet. Wow. Crazy. Okay, so if I got the shoes, how much would that be total? If you got the shoes? Yeah. 175. I'll just take it. Wow. I trust you guys. You guys have great fashion sense. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Lonnie. She holds up the bags with the little, it's Thank got you. the little like oh. raven head on the front and like a 21 through it. It's all edgy. Wow, Lonnie, just... you're amazing at this. We, Johnny, will you just help me keep this away from Irish? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Okay. Why? I just think he's using some of the clothes as towels. Do you need a guest receipt? A gift uh, receipt? I don't know, uh, do we? Do you need a gift receipt? You want to keep it away from someone? Hide it? Give it no. as a gift? Oh, no, it's no, not no, for him. No, no. It's not for Irish. Yeah. You should it's meet Irish. For, it's for Good. me, but I'm Because that's might... for you. It's not yeah, for anyone else. Yeah, he might use it. You know, like he tends to go in my closet and take my stuff and like... Yeah. I, You'd it, like him. It, it, it's gotten... My stuff's gotten crazy. How many nipples does he have? One. Perfect. Yeah. Set it up. Johnny will. Lonnie. I, okay, I'm going to... Johnny loves okay. you. It was so good to see you. I'm gonna hug her from around the counter. And Lonnie, speak as hard you were fantastic. Can. Thank you for all your help. Of course. High five. High five. Give me a strength check plus your athletics, please. <laughs> if you have any athletics. While Johnny's yeah. hugging her. 
Yeah. Um, <laughs> I have yeah, acrobatics and hardy. Yeah, you're gonna need to roll. Uh, yeah, if you don't have any sort of athletics check, I think you do a hardy plus your endurance. Okay. Yeah. Trample is ejected from the star. <laughs> okay, that's a nine on a three d six. Uh oh. Um, like, let me just get my whole dice collection. I was gonna say, she I die. This is how children. I die. <laughs> so I rolled low, but she still beat you. Um, so uh, yeah, it, she doesn't give you a, an earth-shattering um, high five, probably because Johnny is squeezing her as, as tight as humanly possible. And oh, that, uh, I can feel just, my elbow. Wow, Johnny, yeah. you've gotten a lot stronger. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, yeah, Johnny can feel it. Oh. Her clothes are covered in grease, uh, covered in oil by now. She says, wow, the oil makes the corset real shiny. Yeah. Nice. Wow. Good thinking. Shines off to bedazzle. Big brain Johnny idea right there. You want some hair extensions? <laughs> no. Maybe later, though. Before Johnny goes to the moon. Irish would like that. Irish would like that. Johnny will bring You're him back. You're going to the moon? Yeah. Johnny said that. Did you know the moon gets farther away from Earth every year? Johnny found that out. Of course I knew. Yeah. Wow. You're so smart. I know. Yeah. Johnny's going to the moon. You want to come? Today? Tomorrow. For how long? I don't know. Forever. Seems like a long time. Let me check my yeah. schedule. Okay. All right, bye. All right. She, like, bye, walks bye, off. Bye, she walks off, like, quickly. Yeah. Johnny loves you. Walking out. Thank, thank you, Johnny. Thank you for coming with me. Make sure you wear protection. Yeah. Elbows up. Uh, el elbows, elbows up. up. Okay. She like knocks over a mannequin with an elbow, <laughs> like. <laughs> Good. Yeah. I, so I really we ran like her. your wow. sister. Yeah. We should have her over. We wow. should. Yeah, to the moon. Lonnie, Lonnie's great. You'd love her. I mean. I mean, yeah, I yeah. would love to see uh, Bonnie. Maybe, maybe they would be a good match for Irish. I mean, yeah, both at the same time, they would crush him. Disgusting. So you, you, I think you have a very different opinion of of Beatrice. Um, yeah. Like she always picked on me a little bit. Like, she's like she way this. different also. She's like diminutive. She's really small. Oh. Yeah. Okay. She's, she's actually the big brain of the family. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Beatrice Flash, uh, created by Bamf Kyle. Uh, she's got glasses. She's short. She's, uh, generally been super judgy through your whole life. Uh, and yeah, she has a, she has a child that she did not name Johnny, but her ex-husband named this child Johnny. <laughs> yeah, you'd like Bonnie. She's really smart. Just like you. Just like me. No, I'm yeah. well, someday. I mean, Bonnie didn't get the genes, but she got the gains. The gains. To rhyme it. Yeah, no, no, I would love to meet more of your family. Yeah, that'd be great. Do you, I mean, you, you said you have a mom and a dad, too? Yeah, yeah. Mom gave birth to Johnny, just like everybody else. Crazy, huh? Did, did they, um, you know, do they live here? Like, where where do they live? Johnny's not sure. He'd have to ask Lonnie. Oh, at least Johnny. we know where Lonnie is now. I Johnny mean, hasn't talked to Dad in a while. Oh. Yeah. Did something did something happen? Dad was buffer than Johnny. Johnny left on a quest to become buffer than Dad, only to return until he was buffer. That's why Johnny's got to go to the moon. You see, Johnny would weigh fifty-seven point five pounds on the moon. Did you know that? One sixty your weight. Johnny, write it up. Wow, I mean, so that means Johnny could finally bench 450 even beyond because it's one sixth of the weight. Wow, I mean, yeah, yeah, I w wouldn't you miss your family though? I mean, yeah, we call sometimes though. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, yeah, that works. I mean, yeah. yeah, I don't think it's as complicated as my relationship with my dad, so that's good. No. That's good. That's Nothing good. like what you got going on. No, dad doesn't want to kill Johnny, that'd be a little crazy. Johnny, I need some advice. How do I not yeah. care? I get so nervous around my dad. You just gotta not care. <laughs> but it's it's a lot harder than that. Like, he makes me yeah. so nervous. Okay, okay, so. What Johnny suggests maybe is whenever Johnny gets a little nervous, likes to flex, just kinda, you know, work the core. It helps get your abs. Abs are the hardest ones to work too. So, you know, they say 90% of it is in the kitchen, but Johnny eats hotties all day. Can't help it, they're amazing. But. If you flex at dinner a little bit, maybe you assert your dominance, maybe your, your father will see your traps come up over your shoulder a little bit. I mean, you know. but I start trying to do it. Yeah, yeah. Just is, like, it, is it working? From the court, from the court. Yeah. 
Yeah, Johnny can see it. Yeah, you got a little bit. About an inch. Oh. Devastating inch, Johnny thinks. It's hard to oh, not yeah. make Title Johnny sex tape. Yeah. <laughs> ah, ah. <laughs> um, Johnny thinks so. Mm. You got nothing to be nervous about. Okay, well, I know. Hack everything. I, you hack I Johnny. Know, but he's... My dad's a complicated guy, and... Yeah. Yeah, okay. Johnny's pretty complicated too. So, from one complicated guy to somebody trying to understand another complicated guy, can't. Yeah. It's just too much going on up in here, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so fast, all the time. Johnny doesn't know what to do. And uh, yeah, I mean, sometimes it seems like a lot is going on, so you like yeah. try to get it all out at once. Absolutely. Okay, I'll I'll try I'll try asserting my dominance. Just I'm just less. getting so nervous. Stay it's gonna be fine. Yeah. It's gonna be fine. You're Chambles, smartest yes. person Johnny's ever known. Oh, that's nice, Johnny. Aside from Bonnie, though. But Bonnie hasn't seen, or Johnny hasn't seen Bonnie in a little bit. So you're yeah. still the smartest person Johnny's known. Oh, well, maybe if I meet Bonnie, maybe we can, I don't know. Well, yeah, then Bonnie would be the smartest person because Johnny yeah. hasn't seen her again, but you know. Yeah. yeah, okay. Irish is pretty smart too, but channel Irish. That's it, big Johnny idea. Just become Irish. How, I'm just curious how like, how would I channel Irish to- We gotta ask Irish, Johnny thinks. Uh. Well, okay, I mean... You can break it down into a science. Well, I don't, I don't want everybody to know that I'm, like, nervous okay. about it. Okay. Maybe ask Irish. Irish, how do you be Irish? Sometimes Johnny sits there and says to himself, Johnny, how do you be Johnny? And just clicks, you know? Yeah. So. Okay. Uh, on the right. days. Well, I'll, I'll use the makeup palette he got me and yeah. wear the m midnight noir lipstick and yeah. hopefully, you know, if I believe it, Okay, it's fine. It'll be fine. Yeah. It'll be good. It'll be good. It's all good. Did you like that shirt Johnny bought Lonnie? Yes, that was uh, very sweet of you to buy your sister a shirt. Yeah, Johnny liked it. it. had three moons on it. Yeah, it's like a parting gift. Yeah, or a come with us gift. We want to go to the moon three times with you, Lonnie. Yeah. Yeah. And then I, I noticed that my phone has a message on it. And I look and it's from Tucker. What does it say? It says, listen, I'm sorry. Okay. I'm just really stressed with all the people trying to kill me and killing my friends and delivering their heads. My family's at risk. I'm just doing what I can. And I just read it to myself. Oh, yeah, and nice. I- He's got a call too. Did you get a call? Turn yeah. on some yeah, Evanescence. I just... Irish, Johnny misses you too. Yeah. Who? Yeah, no, it's just, I think it was just Tucker checking in. Um, oh, yeah. What do you think you, of Tucker? I was just going to ask you that. I, wow, I, amazing. I know. We're on the same wavelength today, Johnny. On the same Johnny length as Johnny likes to say it. Anyways, yeah. Tucker, Johnny likes him. Irish doesn't like him, so Johnny doesn't like him, though. You know? But Johnny yeah. Him. He's just doing some, like, he was trying to get on my phone in the bathroom. Yeah. Really? Yeah, Johnny heard that. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. He's just got a Greg. kid. Maybe it's different. It's just different. And Johnny he doesn't want to come with us to the moon, so I mean... Tucker's got some motives of his own. Yeah. Obviously, duh. But Johnny thinks he's a good guy. How does Johnny yeah. know the word motive? <laughs> <laughs> Been doing a lot of reading. He, he thinks <laughs> it's just the same. Yeah. Moon tiff, you definitely no just motive. saw it like somewhere in Raven 21. It's you just, de you definitely dude. saw it was like a word. It was some yeah. kind of like clothing line. Motif, actually, I think is what he yeah. would say. Motif. It's got some. Yeah. Johnny thinks he's uh, got a motif, but uh, he's a good guy. Could be a snitch, though. Irish said. Irish told me he could be a snitch. Do you believe him? I don't think he's a snitch. I just think he doesn't trust any of us right now, and so he's yeah. just looking out for number one. But he's yeah. kind of. You better not screw any of us over in the... Yeah, hospital. Johnny can't go back to jail. You weren't jail? No. That's just how oh. the saying goes. Oh, oh, I was going to say, how did you get out? Because once you're in the isocubes, I don't think you come back. Johnny would have busted out. Yeah, I mean, it's a good... Yeah, you totally would have busted out. Yeah. Um. Okay, so you guys can't stay at the apartment when I'm at dinner. You guys have to go somewhere. Cool. Yeah, we'll go to Greg's. Because I, yeah. I don't know that it's not good for you guys to be here. Yeah, 
But you shouldn't go to Greg's. You, you need to go to someplace public. You need to go someplace public. that. Okay. Yes. Go get go go get dinner. I can I'll pay for you guys to go get dinner somewhere. You can get some hotties. You go shopping yeah. again. Yeah. Johnny can't go to Sing's though. His voice is not feeling good today. And if Johnny goes to Sing's, they're all gonna say, "Hey, Johnny, sing for us, sing for us." Right? And Johnny can't sing today, so can't go to Sing's. It's off the list. Yeah, I mean, go go have tea at Sing's and then just say sorry another day. Yeah, but then they're gonna be like, Johnny, Johnny, like they always do, right? Just give them your autograph. I mean, that'll at least you tide them over, right? Johnny tried that once, but the guy stapled it on the Johnny's hand. Oh. Yeah, that was a bartender. He's mean. Yeah, I, mean, I know that guy. He's he's kind of a dick. Okay, so we'll His face we'll is figure. Flat now though. Did you punch oh, yeah, him? Yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm assuming we're back at the apartment. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sure. <laughs> All right, I, I go inside. And Look I at just... this. Yeah. Here. What the come back on. have you done? Oh, yeah, it's Johnny. not Sorry. brown. It's thought okay. we were. You know what? I didn't Fine. realize it was that kind of daddy. Oh, I, I storm off into the bathroom and I grab the makeup palette that Irish gave me and I close the door. Yeah, guys, craziest thing. Johnny ran into Lonnie, Johnny's sister. At Raven 21. Irish. Holy shit. You should meet her. You'd love her. Yeah. She's amazing. Okay. Yeah. yeah. She's she's got three boobs. Oh. And, and when Johnny was like, hey, Bonnie, you know, staring up at her because she's really tall, really buff, like Johnny, you know, but bigger. Johnny was like, hey, Lonnie, you might like Irish. She's great. And she was like, how many nipples does he have? Johnny was like, one. And she was like, amazing. Set it up. You know? Wait, 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 hang on. Rewind a little bit. Yeah. Did you say three boobs? No, nope, she doesn't have three boobs. Johnny actually has uh, three boobs. Uh, she has three boobs. Uh, doesn't like... Lonnie doesn't like Johnny talking about her three boobs. So don't it tell her Johnny talking about It's kind of rude to... Yes. Wow. If Johnny had four arms, wow. he'd want you to point it out all uh -huh. the time, because that'd be fucking awesome. Yeah, I understand how she feels. Well, I guess the nipples add up to four, so it kind of works. Yeah. Now, also, Irish. Kind of normal couple, you I guess. yesterday, you want to go to Spain, right? Yeah. Johnny's sister, Lonnie. Her name is Leonarda, but her nickname, Spain. Oh. That doesn't make sense. Yeah. Johnny well, knows. I mean, that's kind of cool, but I wanted to go to actual Spain. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, maybe she's been to Spain. Maybe that's... Maybe in Spain, they name them all Spain. When you come back, that's how they know that you've gone to How'd Spain. How'd she right? end up with three oh, boobs? Makes sense. Can't ask that. That's Johnny doesn't rude. know. I, well, I've just never heard of three boobs before. Maybe the third just grew. Maybe, you that? maybe it's a metaphor like you guys are boobs. No, she has three boobs. Three boobs. I maybe don't think yeah, you're accident. supposed to know this about your sister. Off, How are they arranged? Like, the is truck. it one, two, three, or is one above or below? Is it a straight row. Yeah. Yeah, like a belt. Straight row. Oh, wow. belt. Right. Yeah. Interesting. Listen, Johnny knows because when Johnny was younger, they would make fun of Johnny. So Johnny would call her the trip nip, you know, to get back at her. But now it's just yeah, a trip nip. Not, she kind of. That's, not, that's not cool. You shouldn't oh, take the piss out of people's nipples. And how was how was Jambles? They called she... me Scrawny Johnny. Jambles doing all right. Did... I didn't realize yeah. that Jambles... Jambles looks amazing. Yeah. That was her Johnny. pimp. No, We've no. Been going backwards this whole time. No wonder he's fucking pissed. What? Uh, I know. I, pimple. I know. I, 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 I think it's I think it's her her real dad. That's disgusting. Is her real dad a, a mutant? A clone. What the fuck? So... She, she was made, not born, so that's it's fucked not up. Really oh my god, that's even more fucked up and kind of genius. Oh. Do you think her dad laid her like an egg? No, 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 no. I think he must have cloned all the best girls. Wow. Endless well, supply. Yeah. No, I don't think he's a pimp. Well, he seems to yeah, be in all him. sorts of shady business, so. But then he why is she dressed up like that? That was Lonnie. Lonnie helped her out. Looks great. Yeah, yeah. She it's took Lonnie. Johnny for fashion advice. I the think Midnight's called, or the way. lipstick's called Midnight Noir. So Lonnie told me. Actually, Jambles, she went I'm to sure Lonnie Jambles for fashion advice. By the way, Tucker. People tell her to do. She's always had her head screwed on right. Yeah. Well, 
Well, Thanks. yeah, but fucker. Yeah. Jamble said you went in your phone. Why'd you do that? What, what? the fuck, Tucker? Yeah, that's crazy, man. She's got enough shit with her. Please, we already clone. talked about. It. I apologize. The same. Oh, okay. Apologize. All right, never mind. Sorry about that. Then I shouldn't have done it, but yeah, I was just, I was right. just curious, you know. Did it explode? Jamble no, said it... Johnny, if he touched her phone, it'd explode. Well, it made a, a really loud noise, and then it started playing Holy some shit. Some Did it almost dude. explode? Holy shit! It sounded like it was hidden that way, but then she turned it off. So, Irish, we can't take those pictures. We were thinking of. Don't pictures. mess with people's stuff, what especially when they know how to. The war. What yeah, war? I was an no. idiot. But... Plus, in the oil, the calendar we were going to do on Jamble's phone, we can't do it anymore. It actually shit. explodes. We'll yeah, it might it. actually explode if you mess the camera. with it. Wow. Hey, Maybe Tucker, Tucker's got a camera. Ca your life. What? Your eyes must be cameras. I'm not taking photos of you guys. I don't need that trauma. I don't understand. It's fine. No. No. Hey, look, Tucker made the bunk beds while you were away. Whoa! Well, hey, uh, hold on. Are those right? Tucker, why don't you go ahead and give me an engineering <laughs> check plus your logic? Yeah, <laughs> uh, fourteen. Yeah, you definitely put the bunk beds together. You, you sure? told me has to do it because I'm the second in charge when Jambles is away. Yeah, well, I didn't have anything else to do, so I was just yeah, keep yeah. myself busy. Uh, Tucker, Johnny hates hates to tell you how to do your job, but Johnny thinks he got it wrong. This little beam, when Johnny was looking at the diagrams, holding it up to you upside down. See, it goes on top. So, Johnny, did you get anything for yourself? No, but Johnny bought a shirt for Lonnie. Oh. Great. Had three moons on it because we're going to the moon. And Johnny was like, hey, Lonnie, come to the moon. And Lonnie was like, hey, maybe. Why, why, why are you it's telling like, people we're going to the moon, Johnny? Because we're going to the, the moon. Tucker, going Johnny's to the moon. excited. Why wouldn't Johnny be excited about going to the moon? Right, but aren't you going to the moon? Tucker, did you know that you moon. are 160 your weight on the moon? How much would you weigh? Johnny, he'd probably still like weigh half the fucking weight of a car. But John, uh, wouldn't you, don't you think that if you're leaving to get away from trouble, maybe you don't tell people where you're going? That way the trouble can't follow you? That, that Maybe that'd be a good idea? Right, Tucker. Now, listen, Johnny's normally with you here, but it's the moon. That's it. Yep. Checkmate, Tucker. Checkmate. Uh, it's the moon. You doing all right in there, Jamels? <laughs> yep. Yeah, I'll be right. I'll be right big. out. That's how they do it. You're yeah. trying to like, yeah, like cinch this friggin' corset. You got the, the. You didn't get the corset. You got the. No, uh, but I got some yeah. sort of bra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's just, it's just one of those sure like bras with like 52 straps on it. You know. <laughs> So yeah, I'm not. I'm trying to like feed my arms through. It's got like three sets of hooks at the back. Yeah, <laughs> so I'm trying to like. I got. I got it. I'll be okay. I got yeah, yeah. it. Uh, just checking. Your, your dad's not a pimp, is he? No, it's my dad. I told you. You like not putting your legs She's through it, it, trying to get the thing. Up. <laughs> Why you? I, I, you think she'd lie to us about a dad being a pimp? Uh, yeah. God, that would be really I embarrassing if my dad was a pimple. Yeah, it'd be really fucking. No, think about that. Pimple. You got to imagine. Imagine What's your that? dad fucking cloned you yeah. to be a fucking sex worker. Okay? You're going to be walking around proud of that. I don't. I don't that happened at Jambles? No way. I yeah. really don't think she'd meet him if that's how it was. Yeah, she wow. wouldn't go back and meet him if that yeah, was. But he's also her pimp, so she's got to. You've met him. You know better than us. What's, what's a pimp? Yeah, he had pimp shoes on. What a what pimp, pimp shoes. shoes. What are they? I think by now Gosh. the door opens Gosh. and little Jambles comes out. Jambles, what's a pimp? What a pimp know. shoe? Little Jambles, pimp? what is, is your, what is your outfit? What do you look like? It's probably like really high heels that are super uncomfortable and like a pencil skirt that's just way too tight. And like would... something with a bunch of straps all over the shirt. And it just, it looks like a it looks like a goth bondage kind of situation. And there's just like straps from the bra everywhere. And I tried really hard with my makeup and I have really dark lipstick on. Yeah. And I, I try to do like put my hair up and stuff. Irish. A pimp is someone who pimps out somebody 
Johnny, for yeah. sex. I Your dad tells that? Maybe. No, I no, I don't think my dad. Well, he might, but I mean, not that I know of. Maybe not sex. Just. She's. You know. What? 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 You're no, clone, no, no, right? no. I don't know what you guys are. I am a clone, but I, I don't know. I'm not my, I'm not a prostitute. Oh. Just a madam. That's, oh my God, no, no. I'm just a normal clone that got kicked out of dad's house. And now this is, I, I'm going to have dinner with my dad. Yeah, well, what are you hoping to achieve with that, by the way? I, I'm not saying you can't, I'm just curious, like. I have a few things yeah. in mind. All right. But you guys should not stay here in the off chance he sends one of his his guys to take care of what Irish didn't. Yeah, yeah but you All should right, be careful yeah, we as well. It. We got to clean out the fucking place, leave it to it. Well, luckily we made the bunk beds in time. I, I thank you for making the bunk beds. Yeah, yeah. you're welcome. Okay, well, Tucker yeah. did it, so I'm sure they'll hold. She can barely walk in the shoes too, so she's just like shuffling around. <laughs> And the turrets are working as well, but you're never. I, so I, I, you're never gonna get used again. It's, it's hard. They're not. It's not uh, easy to fix. We should go to. Okay, well, you guys turret. can stay here. Just arm the turrets and have. Uh, no, have I don't guns. want. Yeah. Help us out. Yeah. They're gonna we be danger. I, I, I don't like trust that. I, my dad tried to hire Irish to kill you guys. So, do you want to well, hang he, out he, here I, while I, I'm yeah, away? Probably think I fucking owe your money. Can you tell him that I don't? What? Just tell him that I don't owe any money. Owe any money for... For your services. Oh, okay, well... Irish still thinks I... you're a prostitute, Jambles. I'm How not, is I... she not? I got... You said my other thing was not. My face didn't go with it, and I needed to look nice for yeah, dinner. No, your face goes with this one, Jambles. Right, yeah, it's called Forever 21 or Forever 41. Listen, I don't think it's I'm safe. I'm not a prostitute. Also, right. listen, if she's a prostitute, Johnny's also a prosthetic, okay? Listen, I got no problem with you being a prostitute, Jambles. I just didn't realize, and that's, I didn't realize that we were fucking around with a pimp. I'm, no, he's not a pimp. You know, we were just saying how trustworthy you were, and you never lied. I but didn't lie. My dad's a mob boss. Oh. I don't think he's a pimp. No, and that's he, probably a good place for us to take our break. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need to pee. <laughs> it's probably a good really place for us to take our break. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Uh, I love this show. Um, <laughs> please make sure you follow all these wonderful people. Uh, we'll be back in just a little bit. If you have not done so, check out more on Judge Dredd and the Worlds of 2000 AD by heading on over to Worlds of 2000 AD RPG.com and give some support to our wonderful sponsor Morris uh, by heading on over to Patreon.com slash Morris M-O-R-R-U-S and Morris.Podbean.com where you can listen to the MP3 version of this show as well as Crash City and a podcast that Morris does uh, for role-playing games and uh, in-depth information and news about uh, about role-playing games check it out it's wonderful stuff um and we'll be back in just a little bit hang tight for more sector 49 guys back in just a little bit
Welcome back, everybody, to Table Stories Sector 49. Welcome back. We return as uh, the conversation about Lil Jamble's father being a pimp probably went on for way too long. And uh, it, it, it took a lot of convincing, and Lil Jamble still has not convinced Irish that uh, her father is not a pimp. Uh, Irish, the pimps work for her dad. If if that's right. even a thing, I mean, so you I mean, think I'm, so that just makes him super pimp? No, do you, you think yeah, I'm a like prostitute? The king pimp. Irish. Yes. Wait, you are. Uh, it's what, okay. I'm when okay have I given you the impression that I'm a prostitute? Turn around and look in that mirror. Because of what I'm wearing. And he said you're a prostitute. Oh, who, did? who did? I'm pointing at Taka. I highly doubt Tucker said I was a prostitute. Thank you. He, well, he said your dad was a pimp who cloned you to work. 
that's not what happened. From his best girls. No, my, the original... It's hard to find good girls. Oh, God. So the, the best ones. The it's original... okay. No, my dad's not a pimp. He does a lot of bad things, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't pimp women out. Okay. Does he pimp men out? I don't think so. I mean, oh, okay. you can never really truly know someone, but I don't yeah. think he does that. Yeah. What do pimp shoes look like? I don't think there's Probably a specific like... kind of... I don't think there are Jambos, pimp... Yeah. Uh, I think they're flashy, pimp. maybe? Wow. Like, they're flashy? Yeah, yeah. But it's like, like what are they these? Uh, yeah, oh, they've got some goldfish in them. Swimming around. Flashy shoes. I... But I... Uh, GB LEDs, maybe? Wow. They light up, the pimp shoes light up, and that's how you know someone's On the sides, when you step? Oh, Johnny always wanted those when he was a kid. Uh, I want some of those you now. You want it to be a pimp? Yeah. If, uh, it, if it means having shiny shoes, then yeah. Johnny wanted to be a pimp. Frank still wants to be a pimp. Okay, uh, Jambles, you, you sure it's safe for you to, to, to go? He ain't gonna, like, well, you lock you up so you stop giving him a bad name or whatever? I mean, I... The only people I ever talked, I be, I mean, I really didn't don't talk about him. I've only talked to him, to you guys. I mean, right, it, but you know, people hear things and know things, and people talk, and and some, if he knows, someone else things. might know. Yeah, and some people say things in public real loud, and they don't even know they're doing it. I look over to Johnny Irish. <laughs> well, I'm going to meet him. I guess we could come up with some sort of contingency plan so that... What, is he infected? No, it's contingent. Like, in case something happens, there's another plan in place so that I don't get locked up. But if he's infected, you want to be locked up, no? I mean, what if... There's no diseases involved here. Like, there's no illnesses or... Then why the hell do we need a contingency plan? Because it's, it's a word you use to, like have a plan and then you have a backup plan. I don't plan. think it's worth your time explaining what it means. He's got you just call it a plan B. Okay, plan confident, B. Confident plan, yeah. Well, yeah, you probably need plan B. Your work line of work. Right, well, um, and Johnny I, was telling us how he was telling everyone that he's going to the moon because it's yeah. the moon. And, yeah, we're and, on the moon. And I reckon there was maybe a chance that people were following you because your dad's paying close attention to you, apparently, that they might have heard that. And do you think he wants you going to the moon? I'm not going to tell him I'm going to the moon. I'm going right, to. But okay, he might I'm already not... know because Johnny. Johnny I mean, didn't tell only... your dad you're going to the moon. Yeah, he only promises. yelled about it at Raven 21, which I highly doubt my dad's got anybody. Yeah. Lonnie wouldn't tell Gamble's dad. Come on. Duh. If he does. He would know if he He's got, I, it's my dad, regardless of how weird I get around him, I can, I can talk to him. Yeah, I, well, I'm trying to get that across to you. He definitely cares about you. Like a dad just doesn't stop caring about his little girl. That, that's, that's not how it happens. Well, he's got a weird way of showing it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What if he's a robot? And I'm sure my little girl out here by disappearing all day. He was and... programmed wrong. Yeah, my dad skipped out and Shannon. So. Most dads. Right? Some dads are dead. Irish, that's not helpful. Well, it's just, okay. Well, all right. Seems just like saying. it's a common theme among us. Well, I don't have a dad, so plus one. Yeah, Johnny's dad is great. Really big though. Sometimes mean. Uh, so when y'all gonna go to the moon as well? And uh, tomorrow. That's a. That's little, when we gotta go talk to the, the the lunar city one planning. Can't you do no, it on? We, we can do that, and you can go and speak to your dad. Yeah. Wait, uh, you guys... That's. Yeah. <laughs> we'll do that. Yeah. Yeah. We'll set up the moon plans. Johnny knows what? everything about the moon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll okay, get you a we'll... ticket. Can yeah. I have that money there so I can buy us a ticket? Don't leave me with them. How much is a ticket to the moon, Johnny? Johnny, there's another one. You Gambles. were supposed to be looking it up. Yeah, that's your job. Yeah, maybe you should just book it all online before you what? go. Gambles. Use Jambles' computer to look it up. Oh. Jambles, can Johnny uh, use your computer to look it up? I'll do it really fast. 
I open up my computer and I Google, okay. I Google, I look up Lunar City, whatever. I look up the thing and see how much it costs. It's Luna City 1. Like, oh, um, yeah, so, uh, okay. So there's a... Uh, you just take a flight from LAX. <laughs> We should invite uh, her over. Let's see. Oh my God, I don't know what happened that to me. <laughs> Go ahead and roll me a. Uh, let's see here. Um, this isn't going to be a computer's check. Let's see if they actually have a flight tomorrow. Um, oh, yeah, they do. Don't check it all. Give me a luck yeah, dice pool. <laughs> me? Uh, okay. Yeah, luck dice pool. Yeah, I don't think you have anything else here that could help you. An eight. Okay. They do have something tomorrow. There is a flight going to... Um, mm -mm -mm. The moon? <laughs> yeah, well, there's multiple territories there. Connecting oh, flights. I thought that was just one city. Nope. Luna City One is like a misnomer. It's like Mega City One, right? It's a sprawling place. Right. Oh. Um, it's not nearly as big as Mega City One, but it's 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 happening. Um, it's on the moon. The moon isn't as big as the Earth. You guys think Johnny could lift the moon? <laughs> yeah, me too. Um, okay. so sure. there is a uh, there's a flight going to a place called. Gray Rock, also known as the Moon. We get any more specific? Here? There's an actual town called Gray Rock. Uh, I guess that's oh that's like God, this package yes. deal. This package deal that you saw. Small town sector forty nine crew in a little moon. Small oh, town. Moon village. How moon much village. does it cost? Does it say the cost? So the package deal. Um, it's a frontier town uh, called Grey Rock, and um, it says experience the uh, the frontier lifestyle in scenic Grey Rock of Luna City One. Um, the package deal is uh, it's flight plus a um, mm, 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 a hotel stay. Um, each ticket costs one-way tickets no hotel <laughs> uh each ticket costs uh 1565 credits oh dude we can pay for this with just the fucking money i jacked off a of daddy <laughs> you did what to her daddy now <laughs> Pimp daddy over there. And you'll notice that the stuff going to Grey Rock is significantly cheaper than some of the other locations on uh, on Luna City One. All right. It looks like Grey Rock's our best bet. Yeah. It's a frontier yeah. town. I. It's probably. How far away is it from Luna City One? So it's it's still technically like in Luna City One. It's still under oh. these oxy domes that they have, but it's it's far out. Um, it's probably like a. I'd say like a two hour drive from the central area of Luna City One. It's a bit of a drive from the city, but I mean, we could fly there and then get to the city somehow. I mean, maybe we can talk to them about not having a hotel. We need like, is this like a vacation spot or is this a place to live? Well, they have, I mean, they have places to live. I mean, you'd probably have to try and find a way to pay for that. But uh, this is like the hotel package. Do they have any like one-way ticket, like apartment sure. packages? Uh, in terms of apartment packages, no. But they'd have oh, just plain farm. flights. They'd okay. have they'd have just plain that we can just buy <laughs> and settle down. And every episode oh, from dude. now on is just us on a farm, like the season two of Walking Dead, where it just oh stop being a go. I mean, I'm so still watching. <laughs> <laughs> Just farming. <laughs> just farming. For Johnny, pick us out <laughs> seasonal plants. <laughs> so there, there's like one-way tickets. Um, it, they probably run about, uh, I'd say 1,300 credits each. Wait. It's more expensive for the one-way versus a package deal with the hotel? Yeah. 
Oh. Well, no, the hotel was 1,565 credits. Oh, I missed but, the number. Yeah, you did. But it's it's uh it's still it's technically it is more expensive for like the one way and like nothing else. You get a better deal if you get the package. Okay, so it I mean there's one way tickets too, but there's I don't know where we find how to what where are we gonna live? We I mean we're go gonna to have hotel. to we can live in the hotel. Yeah, we can get a hotel. I'm sure if they, they try and pick us up, we can elbow us up. The well, hotel exactly. package is for one space. week, just an FYI. Yeah. I've always found somewhere to live. I can I can find us somewhere to live. Why, yeah. why don't you look up for uh, land or something? I'm sure they're looking for people to, to take care of land and stuff. And, and No, it. we can just go there and sell moon rocks. We could do uh, that. I mean, That's they, the they want people to settle, so I, I'm sure you could buy plots and yeah. build or, or even just buy a place. Straight I up. wasn't trained for farming, though. I was trained for... We can get you some, like, DLC. It'd be fine. Upgrade you. Yeah, and you're clever enough. You so. can dissect the corn. Plus, we could yeah. get hurt on the farm. I could dissect us. the corn. Yeah. Yeah, you probably get your 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 medical services are probably going to be in real need up there since people are not used to the life and stuff. But people. Do well. do I see any plots? Oh yes. Um, and if anyone is curious about uh, Luna Luna One, um, it is uh, an upcoming module that's going to be created for Judge Dredd in the Worlds of 2000 AD. Um, there's information on the Kickstarter if you guys want to check it out um, right now, so that we can. Uh, you can. Fucking you can check it out. It's it's wild, been announced. Wild, wild land. Thank you. It's been announced, so uh, the, the, it is the next module here coming up for Judge Dredd in the Worlds of 2000 AD. So you can go check that out right there. Um, and uh, yeah, this is we're going to be doing uh, potentially we're going to be doing one of the uh, one of the uh, options for perps for for this. It depends Zero on what they do. Combat. Let's and the go, scum baby. That left go, Earth baby. behind. That's us. Where the scum. Yeah, right. Uh, rocket launchers in space, Johnny. <laughs> oh my god, Oh my god, yes. Let's fucking go. I want to blow up the moon by the end of this campaign. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to blow up the fucking moon. So, um, there are, I mean, there are places, uh, f for sale. I mean, especially in this, like, frontier area, they're super cheap. Um, wow. yeah, I mean, uh... Like the flight, I mean, getting getting like places, the places rents are significantly cheaper than Mega City One and like sec and in the Matt Damon block. So I would say they're like one third to half the price you guys are paying here. It's really cheap to live there, guys. Like, yeah, really cheap. Wow, those are pod prices. Johnny's gonna miss his pod though. Factor in the income change though. When's the last time it? you were in your pod, Johnny? Johnny doesn't know. That's why he misses it. Duh. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Well, do, would, do we want to book a ticket? Or, well, we need a, a plan, yeah. a contingency plan, in case my dad takes me. This is the continent or plan. Or he Don't kills all of you. Well, we can't enact the plan if we're dead. Yeah, I know. That's why... Maybe you should just leave now. See if it's a flight today and just go. Okay. Yeah. Wait, but Johnny'd have to tell Lonnie. There is no flight today. There's one tomorrow. Yeah, there's no flights today, guys. We just cancel your dinner and tell them that you came down with uh Pimple. The runs or something. Oh yeah, I can't I got Okay, Wait. it's got to be the runs. Oh, um, yeah, yeah. No, no one wants lady to Lady problems. Like Nobody asks about lady problems. Oh. I've used yeah. it 14 I don't times. Tell them you're having a kid. And I'm not even a girl. It works. The plinth's the nasty. Plinth. I don't want. I don't want that going around. Uh, yeah. Going around where? It's not going to follow you to the moon. Gets in your toes. Hey, look, everybody. She just arrived. She's got the shits. Watch out. No one. Wow. Well, they ask where you've eaten so that they can't avoid it. So that's one extra yeah. question. I mean, but it's a please... lot to ask someone to say they have the runs, okay? It's not an easy ask. Yeah. 
Jambles, tell yes. your dad you're having a kid. I mean, That's I don't think... No, don't do that. Yeah. Who yeah, would argue with that? He'd be like, yeah, Jambles, wow. No. Do I look no, pregnant? Your dad. No, Congratulations, you have to say. Yeah. No, you, you really... You... What? Do I look wow. like I'm pregnant? Uh, no, no, you don't. She looks like she's pregnant. I'm like yeah. shuffling around. <laughs> How many hoties has she eaten this week? <laughs> How many what? <laughs> How many hoes is she eating this week? Does she look... Are I'm... you asking if I'm fat? <laughs> no, I think no, she just did. You don't, <laughs> you don't look. You don't look pregnant, no. and it's not a good idea to tell her dad that because he will flip his shit. Yeah, I mean, I mean I could, kid. then we could go out with a bang, like to the moon. Yeah, like dad, I'm pregnant, and then I'm just gone. Wow. I mean, you if you think flight, you're pregnant, you're yeah. controlling, no, I don't. You. Think, I, Perhaps I, we shouldn't. If Why he's I... controlling over you, he'd likely be controlling over a kiddo. No? Yeah. I don't, I don't, I mean, that, I don't know. I, I, Can I clones mean, have babies? I. How do they have babies? I would assume I think they can. So, they unless, they were, unless they were, unless they were edited it, to not I was in a test possible. tube, I'm pretty sure. And then I think. Irish, you're right. Hot. Wait, yeah. so do you have a belly button? Yes, I have a belly button. Do you have a belly button? No belly button. I don't. I too. No, you, don't you were, have an you were a clone. But Show us my, your belly. Be... Prove it. Fine, I don't have a belly button. <laughs> I pulled my shirt up to show Whoa. them that I don't. I know, it's you weird. You don't have a shirt. You you just, the camera, the camera's like uncomfortably close, like right on your stomach. And it's it's just, there's like weird music playing like in the background. It's Everybody's just staring. Looks strange I people, not having it. Yeah, I know. Okay, you can pay for that, but I guess my dad didn't spring for the belly button option, so. That's well, hey, Jack. Why do you think he wants to meet with you? Irish has a blood patch <laughs> on his left nipple area. Yeah, but at least he was born with a nipple, okay? He's not a belly buttonless freak. Uh, uh, Looking like a fucking store mannequin. What the fuck? Why? I they have belly buttons sometimes. Didn't make this choice, okay? Maybe she's a mutant. And she has no belly she button. That's a fucking mutant. That's fine. No, there, a mutant. there was Ketchup. another me. She's what? dead, and now I'm here. What? Oh, Jambles, I'm so sorry you died. Wait, wait, when did, when, well, so like. What was the other Jambles? Wait, you're like? a clone of his daughter. So did you meet her first, or? No, she yeah, died. Oh, wait, and so... then. Uh, and what happened? She got hit by a fucking truck, and they cloned you after that happened. No, That's why you look was... like her. He was in a car accident uh -huh. and she died. And so yeah. he had another one of me made or me. He brought made. you back to life. Wow. Wait, but you don't have like her memories and stuff, right? No, I was a baby and then I grew up again. Uh, uh, so why they didn't they throw on you with a belly button? Be it's an option. Like, I guess you could save some money by not getting a belly button. Uh, how right. much does it cost to clone someone? How much did he a save lot. on the face? Like how much like... though? You know what, Irish? You know? Well, maybe they should clone you so you won't have any as many bumps on your head. I don't know. Why are you so mean to me, Irish? What? I'm not. I put really some mean. of this makeup on that you got me. Yeah, you baked. You baked it. I did. I have to go to dinner. I'm oh, the one who asked my dad to go to dinner. Yeah, right. Johnny thinks you look great. Thank you, Johnny. Yeah, right, so what were you going to say to him, though? Like, Why are you hey, so concerned about what I'm going to say to my dad? I'm just... Um, he well, to he did I'm worried about you is all. That's all. I mean, I know I did some snooping around and stuff, but you mean you're... You're... Nice. I'm are you concerned about the murdering. Money right now. I'm not a prostitute, it's Irish. That's why he's asking about your dad. Irish, in what situation have I even Maybe given off prostitute vibes? You have to ask, oh, right? Is that, do you want to marry her, Tucker? Is that why you're trying to ask her so bad? Yeah, you don't Is even know what she's Is she pregnant and you don't want her dad to find out about the kid? Is that why you freaked out when Johnny said... <gasps> Tucker's baby. No, I'm not pregnant. Oh. I'm just saying there's not a lot of nice people around in in general and, and you're one of them and I was I was just a little concerned, that's all. 
Well, we changed the location to Persephone. It's on floor 434. If I'm not back by 10, I guess you can come looking for me. We can yeah, hang out and see you tomorrow morning when you're doing the walk of shame. Okay, so what are the rest of us doing? We're going to we're going to need that money so that we can get the tickets. I'm yeah. taking the money. Well, just I'll take the six grand, and you can take the rest. Listen, here's here's what I'm thinking. Uh, oh, I want to make sure you're all right, so I'll hang out for now. We can hang out in the stairwell. You know, a lot, most people don't use the stairwells. And then, uh, and then we can just, uh, you know, as soon as you're out, give us a call and then I'll, uh, I'll, uh, I mean, I'll leave. I'll take Millie and we'll go to a new house and then y'all can go to the moon tomorrow. And I guess that's that. Okay. You're not going to drive for us on the moon? No. no. He's not coming to the moon. Jambo's kicked him out. He's not even part of the Wow. Okay. Well, I... Is it close to eight? Mm, pretty, yeah. It's 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 probably like seven. What you can do is uh, set up a, a a panic button on your phone or something that that uh, this voice activated, and if you say mahogany, then it will. Uh, well, don't say it. It'll yeah, say come it. on, man. I can say, say okay. Say okay. Part, the alarm. You'll call us and we can come run and uh, I don't know how much we can do against him uh, and uh, we'll uh, get in the elevator at best. We should be nearby in that case. Yeah, yeah, we can hang out on the stairwell. It shouldn't be fun. Yeah, we're gonna go get ourselves some tickets to the moon and what then What if her dad's a mutant run. and can detect us from like really far away? I think she'd know mm. if he was a mutant, right? You'd know, right? I I think I Yeah. Okay. I mean right? you can hide Just some say, of that stuff. Just a Johnny idea. You never know. If your dad turns out to be a mutant, John's going to say, I told you so. I was going to try to get more money from my dad, but apparently I could just cancel it and we could just go to the moon. Jambles, I got a question for you. What? Does Johnny's sister really have three boobs? <laughs> yes. Not, yes, she does. Yeah. Are you into that? Would you like to go meet her? No. What I, I is was, your problem no, with Frank? Was just, Sorry, buddy. That was no just... belly button, three tits. What the fuck? Talk this about. is inappropriate. Yeah, I was just Imagine asking mentioned. someone asking about Millie. Sorry, it yeah, just kept bothering fuck? me, and I just I didn't what? know if Johnny was hey. telling the truth or not. I just had no, to. Double check. That's Johnny's sister. Okay, yeah, no, she, she, not his daughter. It's Johnny's sister. Okay, Johnny doesn't have a daughter okay. yet. Duh. That's Sorry, just, continue. That's, you were saying yeah, you can't like go to the moon. That was just bugging me. I had to double check. Well, apparently I'm a freak now because I don't have a belly button, according Bro. to Irish. Well, you were look a freak at, before, look at Irish's head. but we just did not know. So look at Johnny's calves that basically don't exist. What? <coughs> Excuse me, Tucker. Yeah. Johnny's yeah, calves are bigger than your torso. What are you talking about? Time. Uh, Johnny could crush you with these. You want to leg wrestle? Come on. Like the width of your wrists, Jay. Come on. Now. Come on. You're all Johnny right. Johnny has a perfect equilateral triangle. <laughs> 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 You know, in in a taskbar, where's human fingers? His fingers. That's not normal. Johnny always skips leg day. No, Johnny runs. So we're all freaks, but taskbar is a fucking sociopath, okay? But at least she's not into. Yeah. I'm literally not a human, so I can't have human emotions. You dingus. Uh, yeah, that's what a sociopath is. I thought you were supposed to be clever. Well, you can have robot emotions, I'm sure, and they're just as valid, and you're just as you're allowed to have them. Yeah, we love. My you power for. cells are Please dying by us. association with you. You don't. I don't we understand. Recharge you? We need to recharge Taskbar. Okay, we'll plug Taskbar in. Go get the tickets, and then we'll meet Jambles tomorrow morning. Oh, yeah, yeah, and you're booking the tickets online. Where am I That's going? Already tonight? done, right? I don't have like, a computer. Your dad. Gambles. I'm not staying over at my dad's house. Yeah, I know you're not staying at your dad's house, but wherever you go. <sighs> no, I she's going to have dinner like an hour or two if she stays for dessert, and then she's going to come home again. And then you're all going to have a nice rest, get up nice and early, pack your things, and then. And where should we stay? Tonight? Off to the rock. Greg's. We'll stay in Greg's. No, why would you stay in Greg's? Just stay in here with the turtle. I what? fixed it, but the turrets are here and I fixed it. We them. don't want to stay in here with Jambles and whoever she has to. No, dude. 
Shambles, I'm so sorry, but... I, I guess apparently Irish thinks I'm just a prostitute now. Is that, is this what, I, this is what yeah, it's what, said. what do I need to do I to said. prove that I'm not a prostitute? Are your arms real? Roll. Put on some feckin' clothes that make you look like you're not a prostitute would, might be a good no. start. I have this outfit on because I'm do going to skin? a nice restaurant for dinner. I'm like, gonna, I'm literally going to open up the drawer with all the oily clothes. Look at all these nice clothes you got. That have your hair grease all over it. What are you talking about? I have not put on any of these dresses. Are you sure about that? Because it's splitting at the seams and I, I woke up one night and I saw it. There's totally like a flashback scene right now that's going on. That's like, whoosh, and we see we see like Irish doing twirls in the bathroom, and he's like, he's flexing. It's Irish, it's, it's Irish and Johnny like doing a duet. They're doing like a karaoke duet in Jambles' dresses. Like, they've got like three dresses on each, for no reason whatsoever. <laughs> my love, there's only you in my... And then it cuts back. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with what I'm wearing? Nothing. Uh, Looks great. Oh, you just... Johnny loves it. Nothing at all. It's just it's yeah. sort of a uniform. You know? It's, it's very... Uh, it's very... Orange it's... tracksuit, I think you're an inmate. You know, if you're wearing like all the, the, the judge uniform, I think you're a judge. You're wearing that... You're a sex worker. That's all. It's fine. Uh, it's not what you're it says to me. It, it says to me nice. is uh, angry, goth child. You know what it says. Okay, to that's even more fucked up it than says, I ever thought you could get, Tucker. Uh, okay, Jambles. It, I want to grab Jambles uh, by the shoulders. Yes, Johnny. To Johnny. It says Johnny. You're good. Hey. Get okay. Those traps. Yeah, don't don't forget those traps. I told you about. I start like flexing again. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, maybe not with the flexing. You can just. Hey. That you look uncomfortable. No, no, one no, of the one of the fifty two bra straps like starts pinching you. <laughs> yeah, you can you can put your shoulders down. It's all right. Uh, it asserts Johnny's dominance. Got this, Tucker. Tucker. Johnny's got this. Assert dominance. No, uh, you just you just. You, are you all right? You... Yes, he's, I'm doing what Johnny told me to do. It asserts dominance. The, okay, I just yeah. want you to say that again, but real slowly. Oh. Right, there you go. <laughs> okay, I mean, I just, you saw how weird I got on the phone with my dad? Yeah. Uh -huh. <sighs> yeah, yeah, just, <laughs> just, just Parker, Johnny's got this. No, you don't, Tend Johnny. Okay. You know, end of the day, what you can focus on is I'm going to the moon tomorrow. I'll probably never see this asshole again. Just focus on that. Say what you got to say, and then uh, then get out of there. Thank him for the meal and uh, wish him luck. Okay, I'm. It'll be Let fine. Let him know that. Man, that daughter stuff. That's tough. <laughs> Ooh. I... You wanted you to be his little girl, and then you kind of. You grow up fucking fast and put on that there little dress. <laughs> and, you, you know, you turn to crime. Well, I guess he, he, he had this perfect... That's the thing, though. He could have helped me succeed in a different way, and he kicked me out. He left me with nothing, and I had no choice. So what did you do to get kicked out? I confronted him. I found About... out. Oh, he never told you. He never told me, and then I found out that he was not who he said he was and i asked him about it and then he just kicked me out well i mean technically you're you're you're, you're not his natural roll me a bluffing no, check he... plus your charisma or reputation oh, please what? little jambles what Damn. am i doing bluffing? Um, yeah you're bluffing you're not that is the definitely <laughs> not the whole story but let's see if everybody else can pick up on that 13 um yeah, um, Tucker, you and Irish can roll me, um, if you have any sort of insight skill, you can roll that plus your intuition. Otherwise, it's just your intuition. Seven. Seven. Thirteen from Little Jambles. And a seven, seven from Tucker. <laughs> Okay. With our, with our powers combined, it's a 14. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 so he, he didn't tell you that, that you were not the, the real Olivia? 
No, I found out. How did it, you find out? I just did, and there's... What do you mean you just did? You woke up one morning, and there was a little note on your bedside table that says, Hey, Olivia, you're not the real one. <laughs> no, you just... Maybe over... she fucking looked down. Oh, yeah, the belly button thing. That'd probably yeah, do. Like, I, I... It's just something as a kid I didn't know, but then when you grow up, I saw pictures of me as an adult, or it just... It, it was weird growing up as a clone. Right. And then I yeah. asked, and it's... She died and came back. You asked, and he so said... What did, what did he say? What did you say to him? Hey, what's what's happening? How did that go down? It it didn't go down well. I see this is difficult for you to talk about. Wow. Brian, talk about going down, Joe. What's that, Irish? Why Why don't you just put on your little ratchet hoodie and go like that? That you always wear. Why the are you so green, against my the fashion, The green thing Irish. with the gray that you always wear. Why well, are you so hoodie. against it? My I just don't understand why you're wearing it. All of a sudden. I've, there's a nice restaurant. I can't wear my ratchet hoodie to a nice restaurant. Oh, well, why did nobody tell me that? I thought she was a prostitute. This whole time. She's going to a nice restaurant, Tucker, you fucking freak. I interrupt. Oh. Well, I'm a Tucker. Wait, so now you don't think I'm a prostitute? No, are you just showed up dressed like that? He's saying your dad's a pimp. I'm thinking, oh, she's a, this whole time. And then he's saying, oh, I'd like to hire her because she's a, dressed like a 14 year old. I'm thinking, what the fuck's what? going on? And I missed something here. He's saying, I like girls with big three tits and no belly button. Pete never said that. Well, we look at it this, this, this way. Um, I don't know all the details of what went down with y'all, but he lost a little girl and then well, I didn't come back and then kind of lost you again. I mean, that's tough. I, I couldn't imagine losing Millie once, never mind, you know, what's going on with yeah. with y'all. So she was lost and he didn't find her. Duh. Come on, Tucker. <sighs> You're a dad. Johnny's not a dad. Johnny knows that. Yeah, and he kicked her out. She didn't get lost. It's not like he lost her in a supermarket. It takes a lot for a dad to kick his girl time. out. There's... Doesn't sound like it. You said there was a note that said that she was a clone. No, and then that was just a... When my confused. dad kicked me out, he said that I wasn't the real... his real daughter anyway. And he just... So, I mean... Well, I mean, it's kind of true in a sense. It doesn't make you any less of a, like a person. And yeah, you're sort of adopted. Like deserving. So, of... if we kill him off, do you get his stuff? Or I don't know what his situation is with his money. That I don't would know. Be I guess thing. you can go and apologize for not being the person who he wanted you to be, which is. Don't apologize. You are you. No, it's not a real apology. It's one of those it's one of those fake fuck you apologies where you apologize, but you're basically just being sarcastic. So should I show up to dinner and be like, hey, dad, when you die, do I get all your money? And then yes. you swoop in with a rocket launcher and his head off? I mean, no. that sounds like a great plan. Well, the first bit would be okay. good to know. So is that what we're doing? No, Wait, no, moms. Irish, no, no, don't do that. I think okay. you go and get your get your clo closure and make your peace and then... Uh, Starting your new life on what was it called? Gray, gray Rock. Gray, gray Rock, yeah. Yeah, the moon. Yeah. Let's go I to grab, the moon. Yeah. I grab my little hoodie because Irish has made Jamble self conscious and she puts the hoodie on over what she's wearing. Mm -hmm. uh, well, oh, it looks even better. Wow. It Real weight. Uh, Johnny, that's, that's an amazing combo. Thank that you. looks okay now. Yeah. Kinda. You could you take it off us. in the restaurant. It's yeah, okay. I doesn't right. think it's that kind of restaurant. You should uh, be heading off, by the way, if you want to get there. Yeah, I'll... I'm gonna we'll, go. We'll be in the stairwell, so if you need us to come, then... Can we go in if... the elevator to yeah, the floor yeah. before? That's a lot of walking. Oh, I'll... yeah, I'm not doing all that. We'll, we'll take the elevator up, head to the stairwell, and then For if you sure. need us, give us a call, and we'll come along and 
Well, I'll set a, a code word. Jump. Yeah. And then um, if you hear the Golden Girls, and then it'll also ping your phones. All right. Yeah. You can always just do that thing where you go, oh, I have to go to the bathroom and then you just leave. True. Yeah. And then Maybe just... problems. Remember, no yeah. questions. Kid, don't forget the kid. No, I, the works. Kid. I could throw him off with that, though. Like, if yeah. he, I'm like, I gotta go, I'm pregnant. Oh, I'm having a baby. And then I run out. And, yeah. You know, he, you he'll be, be disoriented. Be yourself. No, you go. <laughs> His commitment. I was, I was never with Billy. I don't know why you guys think I was always with Billy. I said you were with Billy. So Johnny, yeah, you, were, you were with Billy. You told me that you were engaged. No, I, who, no, I didn't. Well, I told your dad that. You told my dad I was engaged to Billy? B Billy's the, the champ that was with yes, you. Yes, yeah. the champ. Yeah, really good guy. I didn't know I was supposed to lie to him. No. Uh, <laughs> I was he, never engaged to uh, Billy. Uh, plus, you found all that hair in her shower oh. drain. Not anymore. No. Oh my God! No, you told him that. I don't think he's gonna believe it. It doesn't seem like. He seems like a don't smart even believe person. It. Well, I yeah. thought it'd make him feel better, like he more sad for her, that her fiance died. And it was all this sadness, and she's sad, and that's why she's angry with him and running away from home. Yeah. I didn't know that she was oh, a clone no. with no belly button and she's a... I, I was already engaged once. That didn't go over too well with him because they never asked him for his... Right. First permission. of all, maybe stop Who getting was engaged it? the first time I... you meet him. Oh. Okay. We all don't right. know this story. Oh. There's no story. There's a story. I have to go. Story. Well, we're coming with you in the elevator anyway, oh, so you can tell us on the way up. No, it's the top no, of a out. And an, an E-network microphone up to your mouth. <laughs> it's personal. No, I'm just okay. messing with you. You don't have to. You don't have to do it. I'm just messing with you. Johnny's got to pee. You have to. Oh, okay. Don't leave Johnny behind. Okay, you yeah. go pee. Iris, you need I to mean... pee as well before you go. You two can have a sword fight or something. Mm, okay. Yeah, Can that actually be like foam swords in the bathroom <laughs> where they would have fights in the showers? But, but, yeah, it's but one we, of the we... it's one of the things that Johnny swiped from the from the front uh, from the information the line. Is, is that we start yeah. pissing, but then don't finish pissing before we start sword fighting. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> <that was fine. laughs> That's uh, all Tucker. Jambles. Let's save bar. time. Let's go together. In the, in the background, and be, oh yeah, let Johnny move over one sec. Yeah. Uh, Tazbar, thanks a lot for everything you've done. I guess, I mean, after today, I'm just like crashing gonna... randomly oh. in the background. Oh, <laughs> Probably let me grease that. On guard. Uh, I mean, I appreciate it. And Jambles, I'm, I'm sorry about the stuff and betraying your trust and all the rest of it. It's just, with you leaving and that opportunity was there, I just, uh, uh, I, I, you understand. So you're for sure not going to the moon? I can't take that chance. I mean, I got a, a it's not a good thing here, but I got a thing here and uh, I, I mean, I know people and I mean, I it's always a chance I could reach out to my old boss and maybe he'll take me back on at some point. And, and I, you know, I'd be able to keep me really comfortable. I just am worried about Millie and Shad and Primrose is gone, so no driving jobs for you. Uh, I'll pick some up in De Niro block or, or some other block. But, Somewhere. Mm -hmm. Always people looking for drivers, especially after the robot wars, you know. Like, people don't trust robots anymore. I could I could probably even start out on my own. Just I just need to get some wheels. And with the money from the race, I could probably pick up something. So, I mean, I might be all, I think I'll be all right, actually. And I, just to be really open with you, I I, I did take half the winnings and, and give it to Meredith, and I was just splitting the other half with y'all. Like, just I kind of assume so. Kind of, maybe don't tell Irish that. Yeah, don't tell Irish. Though he was yeah, trying to give first. us to give all the money, so maybe he'd be okay with it. Also, he did take money to kill us, so. I guess we're even. Don't feel too mm -hmm. bad. Yeah, but um, I'm walking out in three seconds. 
but yeah, thanks. Yeah. I guess. Yeah, yeah so that's why I've got grease up that bit, okay? Yeah. It's not weird. Yeah, no, Johnny doesn't think so. I think you guys right. should lay off the grease for a bit. Like it's. I'm, I'm only wearing a sarong. I think we're in like a fresh. <laughs> Don't you want to put like a shirt on, Irish? Did it's, you wash it's your hands? Ah. It's definitely one of little Jambles sarongs. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm like reaching for the ratchet hoodie that she wears all the time. I'm wearing it. Oh, <laughs> in that case, I'll reach for the thing that she had on before she left. <laughs> <laughs> the thing that she did almost wore. The brown yeah. and pink stripey. Yeah, yeah. yeah and then good. I just start wiping off the oil onto it. I oh, yeah. think Pass that's China. one mystery solved. Yeah, we can't put on clothes uh, without wiping the oil off because it's it gets on the clothes. Sometimes Can we just wipe it on my clothes? Because That's a I, towel. That's my clothes. Oh, what? yeah, this is it. Oh, Johnny, so sorry. Someone would wear that? Yes, someone would wear that, Irish. Okay, we're going to have to take you to Raven 21, sort your life out when you get That's back. That's where Lonnie works. <gasps> yeah. I just, it I is? Get you the elevator. Yeah. We can get yep. a discount. Yeah. Oh. She gave us a discount. All right. Yeah. I'm going to go and put on my usual green, that bra. green hoodie, cool. cap combo. Still on the run from Mr. Gunn, so he still wears the cap and hoodie. <laughs> okay. I get into the elevator and I hit 434. Okay. We're all with you, right? Are That's you somewhere. guys going? What's everybody yeah. doing? Yeah, yeah, I thought yeah, the, yeah, yeah. we're all yeah. gonna go. We're all gonna follow little Jambles to 434, or is Irish going to Raven 21? No, 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 after the okay. the issue, after she's dealt there? with that, she needs to get some fucking clothes, dude, because she dresses like, okay. Okay, so you guys uh, hit 434 on the elevator. And uh, you head up. Oh, I think this is the wrong floor. Oh. Oh. Goes oh. Which one is it? I well, just I just looked in. it up. I just looked it up on my communicator. It's four thirty-two. Quickly hit it before. Oh wait, no. Yeah. Just computer things to it. Trying to speak. Well, we could wait on the higher floor, so yeah. it yeah, doesn't. Yeah, look weird. we'll oh, we'll yeah, go on the stairs from oh, from four. thirty-four and head down, and you can okay. just wait to thirty-two. Four thirty-four yeah, has the National Hardy Museum of Matt I'm Damon block. Ooh, okay. we're not going to the museum. Why not? No. Johnny wants Why to go. Not? We, we need to be. We're we're Plan B. So, it the yep. elevator does go up to like uh, I'd say it stops around three. Oh, yeah. All right, yeah, like we have three fifty something like that, and then you get a swap. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah, three fifty. Then we got we got a swap anyway. Yeah. Here. Big Johnny idea. We can get in separate elevators. There's, There's only one. one people in elevators, you know. Okay. There's only one above uh, 350 or whatever. Okay, so yes. um. Before. Oh, yeah. Johnny so I'm said. going. We go first. Yeah, you guys get off, and then I'm gonna take the elevator down because I can't walk that far in these shoes. Yeah, you can just get off at 32, and we'll head up after you. Oh, okay. Yeah. And I'm going to Persephone. Okay. That's the name of the restaurant. The National Hardy Museum. Yeah. We're gonna be in the National Hardy Museum. We're going to be in a stairwell waiting for you. Okay. National Hottie Museum is on, okay. like, floor seven. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I start shuffling. I'm assuming we're at the yeah. 32. So and I'm Good gonna luck shuffle. in uh Yeah, you go yeah. down to four, uh, 432. Sorry. Remember, you're... Don't you're, forget the Johnny way. You're, no, remember, you're going Flex. to the moon. You're never going to see this asshole again. Flex. Yeah. Focus I, on that. Put your shoulders down. God. How many? It's, it's fine. Okay. All right. I, I guess I'll see you guys later. Enjoy yourself proud. Yeah. Good luck. emotions. Do I think so? Awesome. here for you. Thanks, guys. Yeah. And remember, the murder thing is always an option. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep that in mind. And I probably look like a baby deer learning how to walk in the shoes. <laughs> this is totally. Like, or is it? Are we like? Are we getting? Are you, like legs no. are wobbling. No, we're going up, and then we're gonna come down the stairwell. So Johnny's. Holding the door closed. This makes it go faster. Uh, sure. Uh, if you hold it. Okay. Hold the floor too. It makes it go faster. So, uh, 432 pops up. You get off the elevator. Ding. This floor's. I mean, all the upper floors are like way nicer. In general. Holy shit. 
I've never been up this high. What is yeah. this? Yeah, everything's yeah, clean. We're on th 434 and she went to 432, no? Yep. Yes. Oh, because Wax said 432, so I thought you were talking to Jambles. And she's already gone, right? Yeah, yeah, she's gone. She went down the elevator. Whoa. Where's the museum? The, the, I don't think there's a... The, the, the high okay. is uh, the museum gone. of stairs. Look at these stairs. There's a classical music playing on this floor. Yeah, we, is, we, we, uh, we stand out here. Let's get to the... Just get in the stairwell. By the way, that. classical music, it's like Beastie Boys. <laughs> yeah. Sabotage! You know? <laughs> Get the bag. What is this posh shit? That's gross. Yeah. Where's the hotties? Yeah. You guys see him? Uh, John, I, Johnny, I'm pretty sure it's because because I stay down on the lower floors. I'm pretty sure it's yeah. down there. Down where? Down here? On the floor? No, it's not. They have no, a floor? floor? No, it's like on seven or something. Seven what? The seventh floor. The seventh floor? Oh, it's going to take us all day oh. to get down to seven. All right, we better get going then. Okay, get okay, back it's going to take a while. No, no, what do you do? We're going down the stairwell. I'm wait. not walking 407 walk floors down to seven floors. Where no. Jambles is, back up. We can't leave. We can go to the Hottie Museum before yeah. we go to the moon. Okay. Yeah, okay. the, 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 okay. the receipt for the... The receipt for the flights are on Jambles' computer, so if she gets kidnapped, no one's going yeah, to the yeah. moon, so... Yeah. She's not going to get kidnapped. She's going to see her dad. They're just going to have a nice yes, little time. Yes, wear the backup yeah. so she doesn't. Her dad's a mob lord. Okay. He, you don't think he's got enemies who might want to kidnap her, or maybe he's a I... bad guy and wants to... She said that he's got... We should go to the Hottie Museum. We might not get another chance. And also, I'm in charge here because I'm second in command when Jambles isn't around. Oh, really? So we're going to the Hottie Museum, and what floor was that on? Well, Tucker left the gang, and I am watching him. Right, so you left the gang. Me. He's left the gang. Me and Johnny are going to Hotties. No, we no. Don't. No, Johnny thinks we can go, be back up, and then on the way down, get Hotties. Well, yeah. good luck. Why don't to we you. go to the Hottie Museum, get some Hotties, and come back up? And the Hottie Museum see. doesn't have any real Hotties. That was disappointing what? when I was in. Yeah, what? you can't you can't actually order any okay. there. To eat. What about the six foot Hottie? It, it's Johnny all really in, a Hottie bigger than him. Right, there is, but it's all in in a case. It it's like a display. You, they don't let you eat it. It's not like a restaurant. I know. That's why I went. I was disappointed. I think I just was sick in my mouth a little bit. Why don't we look for some food here? We can't afford the food here. <laughs> and we don't fit in. It might not even serve us. Let's get well, let's let's stick to the plan and I make sure we'll that get Jambles is safe. Well I'm hidden for the stairwell, you can do what you want. Okay, I'll go to the stairwell with you. Okay. Stairwell. Little jambles. Um you get out on four thirty two. And uh, yeah, this floor is really nice up here. Um, there's uh, there's like like well dressed people that are kind of moving about, and they are. Um, uh, I think there's like lots of conversation happening. Um, all of the damage from the robot wars that were done to these floors has all been cleaned up already. Everything is really nice. It's clean and um there's all these like little boutiques and everything it's kind of like looking at a a like picture of like the beverly hills boutiques you know like just like rodeo drive it's got that kind of appearance to it you know all these posh shops and everything all about and you can see oh, sorry, like, go ahead. yeah persephone is probably visible from the elevator it's uh like the equivalent of walking down a mall and seeing like a major department store kind of like on the on the end of a section you know mm -hmm. um it's much smaller obviously but there's a it's persephone and it's it's very like elegant looking and everybody's kind of like wearing you know very nice clothing and everything all about it um you see you know men in suits and and women in, in fine dresses as uh, people are waiting in line with reservations and whatnot. Well, I, I hug the wall because I need the support, but I, like, make my way to Persephone. You need the support? Oh, because of your shoes. Because of the shoes, yeah. Gotcha. 
So there's a there's like a thing where you're like walking normally and then the, the heel just goes sideways. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Heel goes sideways and you keep you keep uh moving. Um and uh no Brad, I've never worn heels before. Definitely not. What the fuck did Oh okay, he has. My feet won't fit in them, Brad. That's oh, like, heels big enough? Heels. Come on, man. What do you think? No one's feet is? fit in them, wank. <laughs> no one's fit. That's the point. They're awful. Um, and uh, yeah, you walk over there. Um, you can see that there is um, there's probably like a menu up there, and it says the um, you know it says uh, Chef Alonzo's Creations. I looked at the menu and then I walk inside. He's got very tall items, you know, it's all like real, like towers of food. It's one of those mm -hmm. kinds of places. And it is definitely like vegan. Okay. I walk in, I go up to the hostess and I, I say, I'm here, there should be a reservation for Gray. She takes a second to look you up and down and she says, Are you sure? Mm-hmm. I'm sure. Give me a moment. Okay. Gray, you said? Yes. G-R-E-Y or G-R-A-Y? Are we going to really do this? I have to just confirm the reservation. You understand? Uh, um, sorry, I forgot how I spell. Oh yeah, it's G R A Y. <clears throat> Mason Gray. Mm-hmm. That's my dad. Let me show you to your seat. Thank you. I'm like grabbing things so I can steady like, myself. To yeah, the table. You, you you totally like cut past all these people. There's people like how rude, <laughs> you know, lots of <laughs> huffing and puffing as you walk past them. I paid of, harumphing. I paid 500 credits to get this spot, in, you know, like lots of lots of harumphing as uh, you make your way past. Um. The place is stunning. I mean, there's all these real plants and everything all about. And uh, you can see there's like this enormous fish tank that has like sharks and stuff swimming in it. And uh, there's uh, the sharks were just for you, by the way. And um, there's like a uh, yeah, there's there's some kind of like waterfall or something um, that's falling into the into the uh, fish tank. And um, there's like uh very f like the place is way bigger than it should be because there's not that many tables it's it's extremely pricey looking everywhere like everything is very expensive looking um there's a bar and um sitting at one of the central tables is uh your father and you can actually give me a perception check as well okay there's no chocolate waterfall, Missile Monkey. We're on floor 432, okay? That's a seven on your perception check. Oh, no. Oh, wait. No. That's, a, that's a nine. Sorry, I was mm -hmm. looking at Tucker's. Lots of ones there, guys. There's lots of ones going on. That's a nine. Um, okay. Um, it's not that hard to see the fact that uh, Miss Joanne is sitting at a different table as well as uh, Mr. Steele. I walk they, up to the table. They oh. they kind of like incline their head as you walk past them. And I'll bow and say, Miss Joanne. And then I'll keep walking to the table. Miss Gray. Mr. Steele. Gun. Mm. Nods and his head. Then, uh, I go to the table and sit down. Your father is looking at a wine list. And um, there's a uh, there's candles and stuff that as soon as you sit down they get like lit up. There's some servers that like rush over and like light the candles. They pour you a glass of water. Uh, 
Um, hi, Dad. There's like some kind of weird like carrot appetizer or something that gets like shoved in your face. Carrots, truffle oil. I, I'm I'm all right right now. Thank you. I I didn't know you were vegan, Dad. He's still like behind the wine list, and he says, "I'm not." I mean, I like vegan food. I just, yeah, it's my fault we had to change the place anyway. Um, why are uh, why are they here? Why do you think they're here? You gonna kidnap me? No. You gonna kill me? No. You They're just can't here. stand to be away from them? They are here to guard my interests. Which is what? Your carrots and truffle oil? Do you plan on being petulant for the entire evening? Are you going to say words like petulant the entire time? He puts down the wine list and he says, that depends on how you act. I feel like, I don't know, seeing each other face to face is much better for me than over the phone. What exactly did you want? I assume you have some sort of goal here. Well, you agreed to meet me, didet you? I did. And well, what was the goal? You I have some to... sort of plan, I'm sure. You are my daughter, after all. Yeah, I learned from the best. I, uh, I need some money because I think I need to leave. That explains a lot. Well, you don't like the group that I'm with, but they've cared more about me than you have over the years, so... Why do you need my money? Is it drugs? Yeah. No, I don't do drugs. Are you, you know pregnant? that. Why is that the first thing you go to, Dad? Do you think I'm pregnant? And by whom? Whom do you think I'm pregnant by? Perhaps your chimp boyfriend? <laughs> I was never <laughs> with the chimp. And who told you that? Hmm? Was it with your little spy cameras? Or was it, you know, word of mouth through the streets? It's not exactly a difficult thing to learn anything about you these days. Your activities haven't gone unnoticed. You should be very thankful at my intervention as well. Well, I do appreciate the cleaners. Miss Joanne said she was going to look into who sent them. Did she find out who sent them? The individuals that visited your apartment were hired by certain business owners. I believe you know them. And I believe that is the reason that you did not want us to go to La Parisienne this evening. Yeah, it could have been a reason. They have enough money. What is enough money? I don't understand the concept. <laughs> you have enough money. You cut me off when you kicked me out, so I've had to fend for myself. And I see you're still functioning. You're still alive. Is this supposed to be some sort of cosmic lesson? Am I supposed to come out a better person? Cosmic lesson. It is a life lesson. <sighs> Things don't always go the way that you want. You have to earn a name for yourself, and you have to earn money for yourself. Which I've always done. Have you? Then why are you here asking me for money right now? 
I mean, I could just use the six G's you gave Irish. And I pull out the cred stick. Hmm. That didn't take very long, did it? Oh, was this part of your plan? Is it so shocking that someone might be loyal to me? Because you sure aren't. It's not exactly a difficult stretch to imagine someone like that being easily purchased. And yet he didn't do what you asked him to do. He didn't. Not at all unsurprising. Well, that's another loose end I suppose I'll have to tie up. No, you're not going to do anything about it. He crosses his arms and looks at you and he says, I'm not. If you care at all about me, you're going to leave all of them alone. This is my life now that I'm making, and you're not going to wipe out everybody that's in it. You're disregarding the fact that this man has callously disregarded who I am. He has disrespected me. Oh, I'm sorry. Did he not kiss the ring? Is that what you need, Dad? That is what I need. Do you know how s foolish you sound? Why don't you tell me how foolish I sound? If you say that I'm your daughter, then you gotta trust me with the people I surround myself with and <laughs> stay out of my business. <laughs> if you cared about me, you wouldn't do this. I think you need to take a closer look at who your friends are. Enlighten me, since you've got all this inside info. He, uh, he takes out a tablet. Uh, well, actually, no, he wouldn't actually have it. He would signal to Miss Joanne. Also, it's kind of weird. Why are they not sitting with us? They're party. I mean, we had a private conversation to get out of the way. They're gonna, you're going to tell them all the stuff we talk about anyway. So you have like a meeting and then you have another meeting with Miss Joanne and then, then she tells Mr. Steele. Like, it's just, it's ridiculous, Dad. It's not, it's not, I mean, you, you think you're, whatever. I don't need you to tell me how to do my business. She walks over with a tablet. And on the tablet, you see information about Mr. Seamus O'Neill. And you see uh, basically like a list of all these like minor crimes and things that uh, he's been a part of. And it is a file held by the judges. This is from Central itself. And it says wanted Seamus O'Neill. It's got pictures of him in the value store. And uh, he's throwing grenades basically and using a rocket launcher in various places around the block. I mean, joke's on you, Dad. I bought him that rocket launcher. So, I mean, is this supposed to be some sort of like, whoa, my life's turned upside down. I mean, this is Irish. This is what he does. Do you know where this came from? Yes, it's from the judges. I mean, Dad, they've been trying to get you for years. The judges are going to, they're trying to get all of us. Do you know why? The judges haven't arrested me in all this time. Yeah, I do because you the make server like will come over and they've got like 
They've got like a plate of, of like appetizers. Your father just kind of holds a hand up. The server like meekly backs away. The whole reason they can't catch you is because you keep your hands clean enough. You make everybody else do everything. At least I get my hands dirty. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That you do. He goes to another page, and you see your information start to come up. And he says, I'm the only thing standing between you and Judge Mendez throwing all of you and your friends into the ISO cubes. I mean, what do you want me to say, Dad? This is what I had to do. You think I wanted all this? I think you could have made better choices. And like always, I expected more from you. I'll never, I will never amount to what she is, and you know that, and you can't hold me to that standard. No, you won't. And he starts to stand up. You know I try really hard, and you know I care about you, Dad, but I can only do so much. Give me the tools that I need, and I can do better. He's going to sort of, like, walk over to your side, and he leans down by your ear, and he says... If you were any good, you wouldn't need my help. And he's going to stand up and walk away. And that's where we're going to end the session today. God! He's mean. Can we murder him for you? Damn! <laughs> I like him. All right, listen, Irish, we need some bombs. Oh, I got bombs. Mm. I got bombs. Oh, I'm going to that bitch. Dude. Damn. Damn. Not a good enough criminal he is, for dad. He is right I know, right? Don't Which get your hands dirty. Get other people to get their hands dirty. How dare you get caught? You disgust me, child. <laughs> Makes sense to me. No one in this family's ever been caught. I'm on his side. Not in 4,000 years. He's not wrong. <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> oh, man. Good job, okay. everybody. Holy good job. Yay. <sighs> so. Bam. Let's go around the room. Let's do some shout outs to wrap things up. Zagonicus, why don't you start us off? Hey everybody, I'm Zagonicus. I played Tucker Marley for you. He's he's probably not gonna go to the moon, so we'll see what that means. Um when that stuff Yes comes he is. Up. I hate the moon. Why do you hate the moon? <laughs> why does he go to the moon on a holiday? I think, I think Tucker's just an idiot. He doesn't realize he can drive cars on the fucking moon, okay? Like I moon. think Tucker that's a Johnny. I moon. think Tucker can overpower Irish and Johnny. Tucker's going to the moon, okay? <laughs> because Zakotakus does not get to play his backup character. <laughs> totally. Do you just not want to have Tucker totally anymore? had a thought of a scene of like Johnny and Irish kidnapping him and Millie. For no <laughs> reason. It makes any sense. They just kidnap him. Anyway, <laughs> you guys great. can oh, head wow. over to twitch.tv slash I stream over there. Uh, I do cycle streams at about 3 p.m. my time. That's 10 a.m. Eastern for the American folks. Um, and I, I cycle for an hour. And every time someone subs, I've decided I'll add five minutes. We'll see how long oh, that lasts. That is a bad idea. Up yeah. to two hours I'm doing. So it's up to so it's up 20 to miles today. Yeah, Dude, so I cycled awesome. 20 miles today. Um, so I do that first and then I refresh and refuel and tomorrow after that I'll be back on Atlas RP with uh, Wimpy. He's, he was back home visiting his mum and was uh, not involved for stuff for a while and a lot happened. And uh, yeah, so we're doing that and make sure you tune in here on Saturday for the finale of Crash City. And lastly, make sure that uh, you check out my podcast, The Godcast. The first episode will be up for everyone's pleasure on friday i'll premiere it on twitch and it'll be on youtube but if you really want to find out what it's about you can head over to patreon.com slash zagoticus the five dollar tier it's available right now the one dollar tier it will be available on wednesday and otherwise it's on friday and this weekend i'll be recording episode two episode one was with omg vandy episode two is going to be with maquanis 
and uh, it's looking like episode three might be with this guy who you may or may not have heard of boris uh might be doing episode three and then uh we'll see who it is after that never know elon musk probably we'll laugh about memes i was about to say poor people but that's bit... no, why? <laughs> <laughs> that's that's poor people. why would i yeah. think that <laughs> Anyway, thank you, well, Zagonis. That's uh, the topic, and Brad's on the show. <laughs> Tosh. Hi, um, I'm I'm Natasha Tashna. I stream over at Tashna, obviously. We just finished up um, Subnautica and building the best base ever. Even though I have to farm lots more quartz, and I don't want to do that. I'm currently playing through Resident Evil 2, and I just hit my microphone because I have no depth perception. So this. Did that. you build a scanner room? For Subnautica? Yeah, I didn't use it though. I used it like one time. Well, you can use it to find quartz super easy. I know, but each, okay, my base is six floors of multipurpose rooms and they have the alien quarantine system throughout and then they've got four windows on each one. So we worked out it's like 64 quartz or something? No, like 84 quartz for each tower and I have nine of the. Yeah. It's like that. There's like one it's taking a while. Make this use the scanner room because it will yeah. identify quartz for you so that you can just, just see orange gave, boxes everywhere. I just got tired. I was like, this is a lot. I, I usually do it when I'm just sat chilling and I'll, uh, I'll watch an hour of a show and then I'll farm quartz. But you can't do that on stream. It's boring. So anyway, beats Nautica because I'm the best. And I don't know what else to do in the game apart from farm quartz. And uh, we're on to Resident Evil 2. You can get two grappler know. arms on the prawn suit and Spider-Man across the map. No, I did. I know where to get quartz. Oh, and you could, and I, I, had, I had about 20 beacons. And everyone's like, that's a lot of beacons. But I need them. Spindly caves and <laughs> <laughs> like chill cave nobody entrance. Can, nobody tells you how to play your game. You play however you want. I'm the boss someone once counted all the titanium that i'd used to make it and i was like yeah <laughs> okay <laughs> i'm grumpy it's fine i built another one after they mentioned it just to be like oh i'm gonna use some more titanium now what are you gonna do <laughs> nothing it's my base boom someone else who's also probably grumpy now katie peters plays it's me um I am Katie Peters plays. I am playing Dead Space, and I had a plan. This I, one of these days. I need to like study Zakatikus and learn how he does this. Um, I'm here on Wednesday for Nocturne, um, which is PB's horror campaign. If you want to come hang out on Wednesday, and uh, yeah, if you like what I do, come hang out with me on my channel, Katie Peters plays. Thank you very much, Jay. Hello, I am Jay. Uh, I'm Brotato on Twitch. If you guys want to come and watch Coffee Time, it's going to be live tomorrow at noon. Uh, and then maybe I'll finally play Undertale. I was supposed to play it today, but Brad was like, play Apex with me. And I couldn't fucking not. Like, we had the whole Table Story gang in there. We had Peachy. Wins with the boys. That's what we were getting all days. All all day. wins. Wins with the Undertale boys. is more overrated than Final Fantasy X. You know what? It's actually oh. really funny, though. Like, it's actually Any really funny. Part of the, the good bit of Undertale is like the voice acting that you do. Yeah, yeah. I gave I gave uh, Papyrus like almost a Skeletor voice without realizing it, but then like and then he did that. <laughs> and I was you like, have to oh, commit fuck. the whole time. Oh yeah, yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> it's really fun. Um, and on uh, on Thursdays I'm uh, GM and Ragtags. Make sure to tune in. It's just in a couple days. And uh, Fridays I'm on Halcyon Unbound as Achilles, the greatest superhero hero ever, with no powers at all but it's really cool come check it out thank you jay brad i won't play undertale just as a like i, I just refuse um i played it wasn't that good i agree i just refuse to play it there are certain games that everyone wants me to play for one reason or another and i refuse um and that's the end of that uh what's happening tomorrow wax steven Dark Fire. Dark Fire starring Wax Steven. And they have they they swam into a gigantic fucking hole in the earth. That's a great idea. What a great idea. Um and what's down there, Wack? A Kraken? You a Kraken good time. <laughs> a Kraken good time. 
So if you want a crack in good time, check out Darkfire tomorrow. It's all going to kick off. I guarantee it. Probably not. They're probably going to swim straight back out and go shopping for another six episodes. Um, maybe not. Who knows? See you tomorrow for Darkfire. I've got nothing else to plug apart from the fact that right now I'm going to go and play Atlas because it's my own funeral. And I think you should watch it, but not from my perspective. So I'm going to host Brutal Bry from this channel <laughs> because I'm not at the funeral. <laughs> there you go. Thank you, Brad. I'm Wax Steven, and I have been your GM of Doom. I've dragged the players kicking and screaming through the adventure today. And uh, while I have not savaged their bodies, I have savaged their minds today, I think. Savaged their minds. At least uh, at least little Jambles' mind has been thoroughly destroyed, which is great. You also savaged our eyes because we had to look at you too much. I was also hours. savaged because of Irish's commentary on my face. So Roasted. Okay. Roasted. Yeah. Boom roasted. Yeah. Um, so thank you everybody for watching. You've been fantastic. Much appreciated chat. We love you. Thanks for hanging out with us. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for lurking. Thank you for uh, supporting us. We appreciate it. Um, make sure you follow all these wonderful people here if you haven't. If you have yourself a Twitch Prime that you haven't used yet, consider using that on one of these people. Make it happen. And make sure you follow this channel. Follow Table Story and uh, turn on those notifications for the channel so you can find out when our shows go live and everything. And um, if you want to help support, go give some love to Morris, the uh, sponsor for this show. Head on over to patreon.com slash morris, M-O-R-R-U-S, and morris.podbean.com, which is where you can check out the MP3 version of this show as well as Crash City and listen to his podcast that he does with all kinds of RPG news and in-depth information and uh, and talks. Check it out. It's wonderful. Um, and hopefully we'll see you guys tomorrow for some dark fire at 5 p.m. Eastern. Peace out. Have a wonderful rest of your Monday, everybody. Good night. Later, dudes. <laughs>